Yo, what is up, everybody? Sorry I'm a little bit late to start the stream. Not too late, though. Just a few minutes. Uh, yeah, just coming from somewhere else, and just I literally just got home, like, literally, like, five minutes before the stream was supposed to start. <laughs> so that's why I'm, like, three minutes late, but, uh, yeah. Today we're playing Supermarket Simulator. I've been seeing some people play this game. It looks really interesting. The game is in early access. So if there's any, like, bugs or stuff, it's just because it's early access, so... Just note that this is not the final release of the game or anything like that. They're still working on it. But it looks really fun, and I really wanted to play it. You kind of, like, manage and, like, do your own little, like, supermarket store. So it looked fun. And, yeah, so that is what we're playing today. I did not have any time to do a test recording, so I have no idea if I'm going to have frame rate, frame rate issues, sound issues. I've got my desktop audio muted right now. Um, because I'm not sure, I didn't do get to do a sound check, so I'm not sure how loud this is going to be. Looking at it in the OBS, though, it looks like it's probably going to be fine. Uh, it doesn't look like it's going to be too loud. Yo, what's up, Andrew? Thank you for coming to the stream. Thank you, thank you. How are you doing? Life tip, working is stressful, so don't. Yeah, I wish I could avoid that. That would be good. If I could just not work, that would be good. Okay, so I'm going to unmute my desktop audio. Hopefully this doesn't blast your ears. It doesn't look like it will. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pull the stream up so I can do like a sound check like immediately as I do that. Okay, I'm unmuting it. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll adjust the settings together. Okay. The stream is a bit behind, so I'm just waiting for it to catch up to where I... Where I turned the audio on. Okay, I finally got up. Okay, so far so good. Let's get into the game and see how it see how it is. Hopefully I don't have frame rate pro see with these indie games a lot of times the coding isn't optimized and it causes frame rate issues. Versus like AAA games which can have like really intense graphics and like stuff that's really heavy. For the computer to run and like it'll be totally fine it'll run like 60 fps no problem and then you get an indie game that's like dropping frames uh okay welcome to supermarket simulator you'll start with a small store and grow to an awesome supermarket start by purchasing goods to sell and place them onto the shelves don't forget to set the prices with a profit to avoid bankruptcy have fun <laughs> it just tells me all this stressful shit. avoid bankruptcy but have fun okay <laughs> Alright, I'm watching it back in the... Hold on. Okay, I think the sound is probably fine. What's the settings at? Uh, let's see. Okay. There's no sound settings. Okay, interesting. Interesting, no sound settings. It sounds fine. There's not really a whole lot of sounds. I think it's fine. I don't think it's too loud or anything. We seem to be good frame rate wise as well, so yay! Let's go! See, normally if I don't test record before the stream, it could end up as like an ad as a disaster. Like that one game, oh what was that? Bro, that one fucking game, that indie game. The scary one, that was supposed to be scary. It was like the last one we did. What the fuck? it was like a mobile game too. What the fuck was that game called, bro? Yo, it was bad though. What was that game? Okay, hold on. Oh, let me just pull it up real quick. Start price gouging? No, that's terrible. I could never. I couldn't do that. But in the game, I could. It would be funny in the game. Not in real life, though. Garten of Bonbon. Yo, Garten of Bonbon was crazy unoptimized, bro. I had to fuck around with the settings for so long just to get it to, like, not drop frames. I'm like, bro, I can play Grand Blue Fantasy Relink on the, on the ultimate graphics setting. But I can't play play fucking Garten of Bonbon plat past like medium, because <laughs> it's so uh, uh, poorly optimized. Anyway, but I digress. But this game is so far so good. Start price guy. You could probably. I mean, you can set your own prices. Hold on, I need to reset my face real quick. I need to reset my face position. I kind of. I was standing up when I uh, <laughs> when I started my program, so it was like now it's now I'm sitting down. I was trying to hurry and get the- I just come in the house, so I was like- I was like standing up at my computer trying to get it to- Why is the exclamation point above the bicycle? I was trying to get the stream started real quick so I could not be late. 
Yeah, I've been seeing people play this. It looks really fun. I don't think there's like anything to do really outside of the store. There's a mailbox. Oh my god, it's the Ninja Turtles house. Donatello! Oh my god, almost just got hit by a car and died. Holy shit, do you see how quickly it stopped? Bro, how far can you go? It looks like you can go really far. I've never seen- I've watched people play this, but I've never seen anybody, like, leave the store, like, travel away from the store. But there's, like, a whole park over here. Is this, like, a pre-made asset? Did they use, like, a community asset for the city, and that's why the city's so big? Or did they literally just, like, make a big city for no reason? Because you really don't have to go out here for any reason, I don't think. Unless you have to go pick up, like, supplies, and I just don't- I'm just not aware of it. But I, I think they deliver it to you, though. Yeah, I'm, like, positive they deliver it to you. Anyway, look at our supermarket. It's just called Supermarket. Order goods using your computer. But we have nothing. Look how small the space is. It's like such a small space. This door is locked apparently. Bro, imagine in real life, like if on a door that's locked, it just displays locked really big on the door. And then you unlock it and it just changes to unlocked. What is the deal with that? Okay. This is so small. Okay, what should we order? I don't know if there's like a time. Oh, there is. I just saw that on the top right. Okay, so we are being timed. It's 8 a.m. So I should probably start doing shit. I probably wasted so much time already. Um, and I don't know how the time passes. Like, like what's the ratio of time to like real life time? Like every minute in real life is like an hour in the game or something? I don't know. I don't know how it works. Market, management, and bank. So I guess we need to go to market. Cereal. How much should we get, bro? We have $50. Bro, that's... Oh, okay, it's 35 for 12. I thought it's a 35 for 1. Still, I couldn't get a whole lot, though. I only have 50. Let's start with the cheap stuff, then. This is 6 for 8, so let's add that. This is 8 for for 8, so let's add that. This is 13 for 12, so I can get that, and I can get one of these. Can I get one of these, too? I'm pushing it if I do that. Oh, yeah, no, okay, no. I have to go with the cart. I only have 50 bucks. I have to get rid of the oil, but I can get the rest of that. Okay, so that's gonna come to... I only have six dollars. Oh my god. So that should be delivered, and then I can display it on the shelves. Bro, this is so fun. Isn't it weird how, like, simulator games that simulate jobs are fun, but, like, doing the job in real life sucks ass. Like, working retail in life sucks. Like, in real life, working retail is so horrible. Like, doing it in the game is, like, actually fun. I think it's because there's no pressure. You, you don't have a boss. Like, you're playing a game, so you can do whatever you want. Doesn't matter if you mess up. And you can just stop. when, it, Like, you could play it for 30 minutes and be done. Whereas in, like, real life, you have to work your, like, full fucking, like, 9 to 12 hour shift before you can leave. And you're being watched by a supervisor. And if you fuck up, you get in trouble. Okay, so we have to stock the shelf. And you have to deal with real life people. And real life people are assholes. Versus, like, the NPCs in the game, it doesn't really matter. Like, if the NPCs are assholes to me, it's funny in the game, but if it happens in real life, it's terrible. Okay, uh, how do I... Oh, open. Open. Drop, throw, close, place, take. Okay, place. Place all the sandwich bread. Bronze sandwich bread, nature, without add additives. I love how it just says nature randomly on the packaging. What do I do with this box? Is that it? Is that all the bread? No, there's more bread. Okay. What do I do with this box? Oh, I need to set the price, too. Throw empty box into the trash can outside. Okay, got it. Got it. Okay, um, open this. And then I guess we can do this next. What is this? Susu? What is this? What am I actually putting up right now? Podre? Susre on Podre. What does that mean? Since 1865, powder. Oh, man. Bro, I had hamburgers again today. I'm not complaining, I love hamburgers. It's just so funny. It's like the fourth day in the row I've had hamburgers. And not by a choice, like it just it just happened to happen that way. Again, not that I'm complaining. I, oh, I have storage down here? Can I not get to that? Is it locked? It doesn't say locked on the door. Anyway, I love hamburgers, but like, I just happened to like, okay, so I went to meet family on Saturday and we, they wanted to go to this hamburger restaurant that they really like. Which I'm like totally fine with. I love hamburgers again. Like sick. I love hamburgers. Then the next day, we made hamburgers at home. But then we didn't use all the hamburgers that were in the pack. We had leftovers. So then the next day, which would have been yesterday. So this is the third day. We're like, well, let's cook these leftover hamburgers we got. Which it wasn't a plan. It's just we just so happen to have leftover. You know what I mean? 
it was like, I didn't really plan it. It just like, it just worked out that way. And then today I got invited out of the blue to go to a friend's house and he's cooking out. He's cooking hamburgers. And I'm like, bro, that's crazy. And I was like, of course I'm going to go. And of course I'm going to eat the hamburgers because I love hamburgers. It's just like, whoa, I just had hamburgers four days in a row and I didn't even plan it. Okay, what should I make the price? Average price, average cost is 99 cents. So I guess that's what I spend. That's what I pay. And market price is 396. So do I make it exactly 396? That seems like the play, right? Because if you make it higher than market price, people are going to be reluctant to buy it because they can get it cheaper elsewhere. If you make it too cheap, if you make it cheaper than market price, you'll outsell your competitors, but then you won't make as much of a profit. It seems like everyone benefits if everything's the same price at every store. That's what it seems like. I mean, I will notice the same products will be the same price. Like just today, I was at Walmart. I saw a controller for the Nintendo Switch. It's like a wireless controller with like RGB lights in it. $45. I saw the exact same controller at Best Buy for the exact same price, $45. Like, I think they do that on purpose. I think they do that so like everybody benefits from it. I think. I don't really know. I have no, I don't know nothing about marketing or like business. Cause like you can make yours cheaper than your competitor and you'll sell more than your competitor, but then like you won't make as much profit from it. It's like if you can sell it for more, sell it for more, right? So you can make more profit. People will pay it. If people will pay, then sell it for more, right? Oh, we're not open yet. Okay, I gotta open the store. Oh, how is my audio? Oh, my first customer. Hello. Irashaimase. Welcome. Oh my god. He's buying something. Okay, I gotta check this out. Interact with the customer. Interact. Oh, all I do is click on it and it scans it. And then I take his money. And then I take his change. But I actually have to give the correct change. Bro, he bought $4 worth of shit and paid with a $100 bill. Bro, I would be pissed, bro. Okay, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17. Okay, uh, give. Approve. Okay, I have to press space. That was weird. Okay. You just click it. I kind of wish you kind of clicked and held it and like drag it across. There's no scanner here either. They should have made it where it's like, oh, he's paying my credit card. I have to enter the total. Oh, I can't even see the screen. Oh, okay. I was going to say the screen is so tiny. 854. But, oh, shit. Okay, come on. It would do the decimal automatically in real life. In real life, it would have put the decimal point automatically. Anyway. I kind of wish there was a scanner and I had to click and hold and like drag it across the scanner. That'd be nice. Bro, I can't believe that guy paid with a hundred dollar bill for like four dollars worth of shit. Can you believe that? The nerve of some people, bro. Bro, eventually we get to hire people and then like we don't have to do this shit. They'll like, we'll get to hire someone to like work the register. Bro, this is easy, bro. Running your own business is so easy. Why doesn't everyone do this? It's just so easy. Just order some product. You only need 50 bucks. Get started. <laughs> and stock the shelves and then set some prices. And then there you go. Bro, $100 and they, the total was $8. That's crazy, bro. Okay, we got 40. Uh, 46. Oh, shit. I did a stupid thing. It's fine. I gave her two nickels instead of like... A dime. <laughs> it's fine. Bro, don't pay with a hundred. You all are crazy, bro. Imagine if this game made you go to the bank and get change. I used to have to do that. I used to have to get change for the registers at one of the stores I worked at. And then it was like really annoying when people would pay. I'd be like, bro, you've taken all my chain, bro. You're 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 fucking the cost of your your order was like five dollars and you're paying with like a hundred dollar bill. It'd be like four dollars and some change. They give me a hundred. I'm like, bro, all my change is gone. Like, the amount of hundred dollar bills we got, like, my change would already be gone if this was real life. Whoa. I pressed the wrong thing. What am I doing? What am I looking at? Remove. Okay, okay. Two dollars, okay. I don't know what I'm doing. And 92 cents. Uh, 75, 85, 90, 
I do too. Try not to make the customers wait too long. I'm trying to go quickly. Okay, change one dollar and four cents. Nice. We have to perform 95 checkouts? Bro, I, I kind of thought we'd be done for the day. Like, the store would be closed already by now. This is kind of going by real quick. Oh, I see the time's moving now. I guess the time didn't start moving until we opened the store. Which is kind of weird. You would think it would count the time that we were like... Uh... Like the time that we were like ordering the products. But it wasn't. Time was like frozen. Frozen. Let it go. Let it go. The cold never bothered me. Anyway, what is that ugly ass t-shirt you got on, bro? That t-shirt is awful. What is that? Did you get that at like... <laughs> Where did you get that? Uh, who even sells a t-shirt like that? I've never even seen anybody sell a t-shirt like that. Bro, you came back. Bro, you just bought... What are you buying now? What is this anyway? Pasta? It's pasta. What did you just buy? You bought bread and then you're like, oh shit, I forgot the pasta. I better go back for the pasta. Um. 88. Nice. Flower. And you're paying with a card. A credit shard. A credit shard. A credit shard. Credit chart. Okay, I still have to perform several. I only perform 14 checkouts. Oh, do I order more shit or like. Now that I have more money, could I start ordering shit now? Or no? I just wait till the end of the day. I still have plenty of stuff, right? But I'm gonna have to order like more racks and stuff and like increase the space in here and get like. F like coolers to get so I can get like drinks and stuff, you know? Oh, exact change. Nice. How nice, he gave exact change. That is so nice of him. I love it when that happens. I absolutely love it when we get exact change. It's so good. It's so good. If you can give exact change, do it. Like if you have change, just just do it, bro. Use it. You got all those coins, bro. Use the coin. Like give exact change if you can, if possible. If possible. Bro, should I like throw on some music or something? It's kinda like quiet. Other than the sounds of the birds. I feel like I have to talk a lot to overcompensate for like the lack of sound. And like just things going on in the game. It's starting to feel like actual work. I'm starting to get like PTSD of like doing this kind of shit. Just standing here for hours and just doing this monotonous like ringing people out over and over again all day long. I'm starting to get those vibes and it's not good vibes. So it's like... I'm starting to get bored. Use that change. That's right. Use the change. Like, oh, this is giving me flashbacks, bro. I'm, I'm actually starting to, like, hate this a little bit. Not that the game is bad or anything. I, I think the game is really cool. I'm just like, oh, God. I'm, like, doing the thing that I used to do all the time that I hated. That I did for hours. But now I'm doing it by choice. And I'm not getting paid for it. <laughs> like, why, why am I doing this to myself? No, this is way better than doing it in real life, though. It's gonna be cool when we can actually, like, right now we just have the most basic stuff. But when we actually, like, get, uh, like, coolers in here and stuff. And we have drink- Bro, there's no lights in here. Bro, it's so dark. Who would shop in here like this? I would not shop in a store that had no lights on. There's no way. I wouldn't even go into it. We definitely need to buy lights the first thing that we can do, if we can do that. Unless there's like a light switch. Is there like a light switch? What is this? Oh my god, we already have- I'm sitting here thinking we're gonna have to buy lights. Bro, does that like up my- When I use the electricity, does that like up my, uh... Cost? Like my cost for like, utilities? Like my bill? My electricity bill? Or nah? Okay, we have like three more or four more checkouts. To go. When do we close? Because it's almost 9. Excuse me, lady, we're closing in 10 minutes. Uh, I need you to make your final purchases. Oh, I'm sorry, no, people don't. We're closed now, we're closed. I need you all to get the frick out. Bro, I actually did that one time at my first retail job. I actually made... We were closed, right? We were well past close. We shut the gate like we always do at close. We told people like 10 minutes before. We were like, we're getting ready to close in 10 minutes. Make your final purchases. 
you know, and then it came, then 10 minutes passed, it was closing time, I shut the gate down, because it was in a mall, you know, and then, like, um, there were still people in there, and then our company that I work for, like, didn't allow us to kick people out, they're like, what if they're in, in, like, an hour past closing time, they're like, you can't do anything, you have to just let them shop, you can try and, like, make them hurry, but you can't, like, kick them out, bro, it was like a good 30 minutes past closing, and I just straight up told everyone, I was like, you have to get out. It's like, you have to go. We're closed 30 minutes ago. We told you all. They're like, they were like, can we at least purchase our things that we picked out? And like, what I should have done and what a good uh, assistant manager would have done, which is what I was, and I was the closing manager on that shift, would have been to say like, yes, you can, like, you can go ahead and make the, your purchases since you picked everything out. But then you have, to, but you have to do it now, and you have to go. But I was mad, so I was like, "No, you just have to go." Like they're like, "Are you serious?" I was like, "Yeah." <laughs> so I did. There was a lot of people in there too. I was so mad. I was like, "No, you just have to leave." I just kicked everyone out. I didn't even let them buy anything. I don't know how that never got back to corporate. I probably most. I probably would have. I probably would have got fired, or I would have at least got like a really stern talking to and got written up. I would have at least gotten written up. My boss, my district manager would have been so mad if he knew I did that. But it never got around to them. Which I think it's hilarious. Can you buy spaghetti sauce? Because Doki never bought spaghetti sauce. Uh, if it's a, if it's in the catalog, I'll buy it. Okay, it's 9, so I guess I have to close now. I still haven't performed my last checkout. I was supposed to perform 24 out of 25. But no one's in here. That was another thing. If we didn't make our goal, we would buy stuff with our own money. We'd be like, oh, we're like $50 away from the goal. Guess I'll buy a cologne, you know, so we can hit that goal so we don't get in trouble. It was bad, bro. It was really bad. I'm so glad I'm not in that job anymore. Okay, so we close the store. Press enter to finish the day. Okay. Finish the day. Did we make a profit? We made a profit of $102. Nice. You'll receive daily bills. Bro, bills are not daily, okay? They're like monthly. Okay. Starting today, make sure to pay the bills using your computer before their due date, or they'll be paid automatically. The more electrical devices, the more expensive the bills. Oh, shit, I better turn these lights off. Turn these lights off, bro, until it gets dark. Um, I need to order stuff. I have $152. I need, like, coolers and things. Craig, go and buy some ragu. Yeah, I have penne, like, noodles. I could do that. I get some ragu sauce. Look, there's no sauce. I don't have any sauce yet. I have products and furnitures. Bro, I need like a fridge unit. Look how much they cost. Freezer, spotlight, checkout counter thing, small rack. Yeah, I need this stuff, but like I can't afford it right now. Okay, how much if I get one of everything? That costs $93. Okay, what do I already have? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do I already have? I have a little bit of bread and noodles, but not that much. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep. I'm gonna go ahead and buy more of those too. And I think I'll just do that. I don't want to spend too much money. I don't want to spend all the money I made because I need money to like hire people and to buy like racks, and and coolers and things. I think one of each is good. Hopefully, I have enough room to display all of everything. I hope. Management bank. Oh, bills, bro. I forgot about the bill. All bills are paid. Okay. Growth. Bro, what is all this? Purchase a section to expand your supermarket. Hiring. Storage. Storage is 800. Customization coming soon. Product license. Product license is how you get... Oh, man. Okay, so there's a lot. Bro, I gotta save up money, bro. Gotta save that money. Milk, water, and cheese, and soda. Uh, I need, like, a cooler for that first. Bank. Basic loan? I can take out a loan? That seems like a bad idea, because then I have to make loan payments. Let's try not to... Let's try not to rely on loans, if possible. Oh, my God. They just leave it on the sidewalk. Look at how badly this is stacked. This is so dangerous. What if this fell on this man? What if this man walking past... Is that the same guy? Oh, my God. He's cloned. It's like... He's a clone of him. What the hell? That was weird. Like, the same guy. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, it's just another guy in a suit. Okay, the suit threw me off. I was like, it's another guy in the suit. It's his clone. It's the Matrix. But yeah, this is going to fall on somebody, bro. This is so dangerous. 
This definitely goes against some kind of like rules, some kind of regulations. All right, let's put the susu over here. Bro, I wish we had like a cart. We could just load all the boxes onto the cart and bring all the boxes in. Because that's like not efficient. This is not an efficient system. It must not be America. <laughs> yeah, the laws are slacking over in the, wherever we're at. Wherever this country is. What is this? Less speeds. Figue de Tornia. Oh yeah, it's definitely like in another country. Because look at this. Like some of these is like English and some of it's like other language. So I don't get it. It will be gone in a hot second. Wait, what would be? The, the pasta sauce? Look, we got chocolate cereal. Choco Peak. Strong chocolate. Guarantee with whole grain. Raccoon. Bro, it is some strong chocolate. I know some strong chocolate or weak chocolate when I see it. This is definitely some strong chocolate. This is a, this ain't this ain't your grandfather's chocolate. This ain't no weak ass chocolate. Not in my grocery store. Bro, is that actually one of everything? It feels like we didn't get everything. You know what I mean? Like it feels like we have less than what we had before. That can't be possible because we ordered one of everything. The groceries on the side. Oh yeah, the groceries on the sidewalk. People would just steal it, wouldn't they? That's true. They would just steal it all if no one was watching it. Bro, I did. I got one of everything. Wow. It just feels like once I put it on the shelf, it doesn't seem like a lot. All right, let's open the store. That's all I'm gonna buy for now, cause I gotta save that money. Gotta save that money. Don't forget to look at the price, prices versus. Oh shit. Oh no. Okay, 312. Okay, that's good. 396. Okay. I feel like market price is like the key. I was about to just give away the stuff for no profit. Can't believe that. About to give away my products with no profit at all. 598. Okay. Yeah, I feel like you got to go market price. That's the strategy, right? You may have to adjust yeah, that's the the market price might go up and down, and I have to adjust it. Yeah, I don't know if it's smart to go with the market price, or if I should be going higher or lower or what. Okay, 92, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 2, 33 cents, 25, 30, 1, 2, 3. There you go, sir. Have a nice day. Please come again. Mata kite kudasai. Oh, you're going to buy that bread? Yeah, you better buy that bread. You're going to buy this bread and you're going to like it. You're going to take this bread home to your wife and children. And you're going to say, eat this bread. And they're going to eat it. And they're going to be like, I love you, daddy. This is the best bread I've ever had in my life. You're such a good dad. Okay, bye. Have a good day. Welcome, sir. What, may I just say what a fantastic face you have. Credit card? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Can I get a signature on this credit card receipt, please? Okay, I'm going to have to keep this, keep a copy for the store copy and put it in a box. Put it in an envelope and then put it in a box at the end of the day. Bro, these people think I'm crazy. Purchase product license using computer. Bro, I need a lot of money for that. I don't have the money. Lady, where are you going dressed like that, bro? Don't come in this grocery store dressed like that. You dress like you're going to a party, but you just got cereal and two bottles of oil. Now I know you're not about to go to a party or to no movie or to no date. You just bought. Why are you dressed like you going on, you going somewhere special? But like you going home, obviously. Maybe you're just on the way back from somewhere. Maybe you just went on a date and like now you're on the way home and you thought you'd pick up some stuff. Yeah, I guess I didn't really think that through, huh? Bro, they should make a mode where you have to like go to the bank and like get change and fill the register up with change and you could like run out of change and you have to make like a quick run to the bank and get change. Bro, that shit is so stressful. I had to do that in real life. Like in the middle of the day, like, oh my god, I gotta go get more change. But if the bank is closed, you're just screwed, bro. You're absolutely screwed. The bank is already closed. You are screwed. Ah, retail. How stressful of a job. It is a stressful. Two loaves of bread, really? You gonna eat all that before it goes bad? I doubt it. Thank you for the exact change, though. Have a good day. Thank you for the exact change. Bye. That guy was an asshole.
Real piece of work. I hope I never see him again. Oh, hi. Welcome to the store where all the customers are loved and, and appreciated and treated equally. Two oils and two flowers? What are you both about to make? You about to make a lot of cake or something? You about to bake like a shit ton of cakes? You've been watching too much British Bake Off. Now you think you're going to get into baking and you've never done it before. You're going to make a mess that her cakes are never going to turn out. They're never going to be like what she sees on TV. She's going to be disappointed. She's thinking, I can make cakes like that. But then she's going to get home and she's going to try it and like, it's going to be a mess. It's not going to look good. It's going to be like that one SNL skit. Okay, have a good day. Welcome. What a lovely beard and hair you have. And you're nicely dressed. Who do you think you are? Just wait till you get to ma what? macroeconomics and horizontal integration. Bro, you might as well be speaking Chinese to me right now. I don't know. I, I don't speak Chinese. I don't speak economics. Exec change, thank you so much. Ni hao ma. No, that doesn't make any sense. He's leaving. Xie um, xie. What was I saying? I don't speak Chinese. That's right. Uh, <laughs> what am I doing? Exact change. Thank you so much, sir. Oh my god. Two things of flour? Who buys two things of flour at a time? Who needs that much flour, okay? Okay, this is not the, the British TV channel, okay? Oh my god, 133. Bro, I've actually done that before and put the wrong number. Because some, some cash registers, the card machine's connected to the, the unit, so like, it just automatically puts in the thing. Some of them, you have to manually punch it in like that. And if you accidentally fuck up and hit one number twice, then you end up charging them like $130 uh, instead of like $13. Bro, I've, I've done that before. And then you have to give them a refund, but the refund doesn't go back on the card right away. Oh, and they're pissed. They're like, are you telling me I gotta wait like three business days to get like $100 back on my card? It's like, yeah, sorry, there's not really anything I can do about it. Bro, it's bad. And I understand, because I would be pissed too if that happened to me. But it's like, what can you do, you know? I mean, be like, do better and not try not to make that kind of a mistake again. But like, oh, it's rough, man. It's rough. Just she's making try fry bread. What is fry bread? Eighty-eight cents. Fifty. Seventy-five. Eighty-five. Eighty-six. Eighty-seven. Eighty-eight. Have a nice day. Oh, I better turn the lights on. It's getting dark. I wait till it gets dark because I'm trying to save electricity. Try not to waste the bills. I don't know anything about macroeconomics, but horizontal integration is buying out, out your competitors. I see. Buying the competition, eh? Bro, you look like you just come from an Avril Lavigne concert, girl. And you bought, all you bought was one box of chocolate cereal? You wasted. You wasted. Oh, this girl thinks she's gonna bake too. You think you're gonna go home and bake something? What's all these people buying flour and oil like they're some kind of bakers? Native American bread made with four flour and oil. Got it. Okay, I've made $222. Maybe maybe that's enough for a, a product license? I don't know. I don't know if that's going to be enough. Some of those product licenses looked really steep. I don't know if there's anything that cheap. Bro, everybody's baking today. Is it just like a lot of people's birthday? Or like, what's going on? I know people aren't going through flour that fast, bro. I buy one sack of flour. It lasts me like five years. You know what I mean? Like, I never use that shit. I buy a sack of flour one time in my life and I never... Buy it once, you never have to buy another one. Because you never use it. It just sits there on your shelf until one day it's like 20 years old. And then you and then you finally need flour for something. And you're like, well, this is too old. I guess i got to buy a new one. Then you buy a new one. You only use like two cups of it for whatever you're making. And then it sits on your shelf for like another 10 years, you know. It's like nobody uses that, man. Nobody uses that. Two things of noodles. That's going to make a lot of pasta, okay? It might not look like a lot of pasta. You might be thinking this is a normal amount of pasta. It's always more than it looks like. Trust me, you don't need two bags. You might not even need one full bag. Like, half a bag is enough for one person. Okay, have a good night. Um, two boxes of cereal and two things of oil. Interesting. Uh, 34 cents. 25. 30. 1, 2, 3, 4. Have a nice day. I mean night. Bro, people used to do that too if I said have a nice day because I'd get used to saying it but then it'd be like 6 o'clock p.m. and I'd say have a nice day and they're like <coughs> don't you be night I'm like bro whatever it's only 6 o'clock bro it's not like it's fucking like it's not like it's 11 p.m. you know 
It's not like 2 in the morning or something. It's like 6 o'clock, bro. Have a nice day. It's totally fine to say it's 6 p.m. But they will be like, <laughs> don't you mean night? Like, shut the hell up, bro. What do you know? Oh, we're closed. <laughs> all right. Look at all this profit. 118. Okay, so I have to order a product license. But if I order a product license, is that going to make... Like, how much money am I going to... Bro, does it have the actual date and time? Bro, is that the date today? That is today's date, isn't it? It's not the real time. It's using the same time as what the in-game time is. But the in-game date is the same as the real date. That's kind of cool. Now, how do I go back? Like, oh, X. Got it. I need to go to management, I think. And then licenses? Okay. Yo, all this is crazy high, I think. Oh, the cheapest one is 200 Bro, if I buy one for 200 though, I'm not going to have a lot of money. What is it again? Bottled water? Oh, is it all of this stuff? Oh, it's all this. Bottled water, cheese, coffee, eggs, milk, and tea. Well, I won't be able to get eggs or milk yet. Because... Or cheese. Because I need to refrigerate it first. I don't have enough for a refrigerator. Let's go ahead and buy this license. Okay. Then we have $70, so obviously we need to get stuff. Um, I will buy some new things, but not the things that require coldness. Actually, no, they're expensive. All this new stuff is expensive. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna buy the old stuff. Uh, just what I can afford. So we'll do the cheapest. We'll start with flour and pasta and sliced bread and sugar powder. That's 39. Can we do oil? 57. Can we do cereal? I don't think so. 57 plus 35 is going to be more than 71. <laughs> I can't do cereal. So we'll have to... Can I get one more thing and something else? Then, like, pot, like one more thing of pasta? I could, but I'm not going to. I don't need to. Many people who have worked register a bit to insulting the customer in their head. Oh, yeah. Of course. Uh, for sure. Like, all day long. Because there'll just be stupid people saying and doing the most stupid thing, like, all the time. So, yeah, I mean, that's just, like, a given. Oh, I still had a lot of some of this stuff. Like, I might not have needed more pasta, but that's okay. Where's my delivery? Oh, I didn't... <laughs> I didn't order it yet. Watch well, it should be there immediately. It's immediately there. Bro, I wish they... They're, I mean, it's still early access. They're probably going to add, like, an animation where, like, a truck comes. Like, drops it off. That would be nice. Or at least I hope they do that. Yeah, I mean, you can't avoid, like... Like, you're gonna insult the customer at some point. Like, that's just gonna happen. Like, you know, that's just, like, unavoidable. That is unavoidable. I mean, sometimes you just insult them right to their face. Like, I mean, <laughs> if it gets really bad on a really bad day, and, a, and a, you having a real bad day, you've dealt with a lot of shitty people, and you've been patient, and then one person comes in, and they're just real extra shitty... It's like, you know what I think? <laughs> I'll tell you exactly what I think about you right now. Girl, where are you going in the middle of the day with that outfit? No, I'm just playing. You do you, girl. You wear what you want. Don't let anyone tell you what to wear. It's your body. Do what you want with it. As a matter of fact, you look good. But not in like a... But see if I say that, then be like, oh, but you're harassing her. That's sexual harassment. I'm like, oh, okay, excuse me. Excuse me. You ever heard of a compliment? Yeah. Okay. There's a difference between a compliment and sexual harassment. Okay. Okay. There is a difference. Okay. <laughs> Let's not get into, into politics and, like, social things. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I got off of the... got onto that... Let's check the prices real quick. Okay, 312. 396. 371. Okay, it's the same so far. 450. 598. 483. Should I try doing a different price than the market price? Or should I just leave it the market price? Like, can I go more expensive and earn even more money? Or will they buy less product if I do that? 
Or if I go less money, will they buy more product? But then I won't make as much money. It really feels safe just to do this way. But I need to experiment, right? Or I'll never know. What if we take something that's rather cheap? Um, let's do this because it's the cheapest so far. And let's bump it up to $4 and just see what happens. Let's see if it still sells. We won't make it that much more money. Just 4 And then let's see, like... Let's see how it sells. And we'll go from there. If it barely sells, then we'll know not to do that. Okay, I definitely can't buy a fridge or a shelf right now. I have, like, no money. I have $9. How much does a fridge or a shelf cost? Oh, wait. I was already where I needed to be. Furnitures. Yeah, you need a higher profit. $200? Okay. I need a fridge first, though. Fridge A I can buy first. It's only $200. It's small, but it's it's the most affordable fridge unit, I think. So we'll buy the small fridge first so we can start selling the cold goods. What are you going to pay with a card? Yeah, you would pay with a card. You look like the type to pay with a card. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. Or what would happen if I charged the customers too much money? Would it just let me get that money and the customer wouldn't care? Like, I'm sure they're going to add a thing. If you charge the customer too much money or if you shortchange them, you'll start, though, they won't come back. So if you keep doing that to too many people, you'll start having less customers or something. If that's not already implemented, I'm sure they will. But, like, what if it's not implemented right now because it's early access? What if I could just charge them a ton of money? I almost want to try it just to see what happens. Especially in that... And fast food, I hate when someone brings their entire extended family of like 15 to our store, which seats at max 25. Yeah, bro, that's kind of great. And then they all order at the same time and stand in line. There's like 20 people order, all getting in line at the exact same time to order. And it's like, oh my god. And you gotta worry about the drive through too. And it's like, oh my god. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> it's like, oh hell no. Nah. I'll go for. 58. Have a nice day. Hardworking cashier? No, I don't want that achievement. I actually hate that. Don't give me that achievement. Or what if I just go, bro? What if I just go five? Uh, what if I go five, nine, eight, like that? Oh, it doesn't let me. Incorrect payment. It actually doesn't let me. Okay. Damn, I was going to try and cheat it and, like, get a shit ton of money. I was going to try. I could probably use Cheat Engine on this and just give myself a ton of money, but, like, then what's the point? It, it, there's no point if you don't work your way up and you don't earn it. I can't wait till like, the customization options are added. Exact change, hell yeah. Or if they give it, like, customization options, that's going to be so nice to, like, customize your store. 483. Ten eighty one. Bro, can I type on my key on my keypad? Because I could type a lot faster than I can click. If I could type on my keypad, that would be better. Oh, I thought she was about to walk out without buying some. I was gonna say, you gonna walk out without buying something? Oh hell no. Right, we got conversion in this store. You can't be doing that. Couldn't find cheese. I don't have a. I don't have a fridge. What do you want me to do? Leave it out where it's gonna get hot and 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 no good, and it's gonna make you sick if you eat it. You really want them to get sick? Eat bad cheese. Oh, I was gonna say, bro. I thought she was about to walk out. Hell nah, girl. You are not about to walk out of this store without buying something. You're not gonna. Couldn't find it. Bro, I don't have a fridge. What do you people don't understand, bro? You want to eat bad eggs that are gone bad? Is that what you really want? You want me to sell eggs with that aren't refrigerated? Is that really... I, I don't think that's what you want. I don't think you really want to buy that. I mean, you might think that you want to buy that, but I think you're going to find out. F around and find out. You know what I'm saying? Like, eat some raw, some bad eggs that have been sitting out of the fridge. What? Oh, I was going to say, bro. She didn't have anything in her hands. I was like, you are not walking up out of here right now, girl. Hell no. What do you got? Bread and pasta. Exact change. My man. Exact change. Let's go. What do you got? A card? That works too. Because then I don't have to deal with the change. My man. Have a nice day. Couldn't find bottled water. Okay, that one's on me. That is my bad. I could have bottled water right now, but I don't. 
Fair enough. The thing that frustrates me the most is that at my store we had a clearly defined area where you were supposed to line up to order. Yeah, and they just kind of chill wherever. They just form a big group and just like take up all the space so nobody can get through or get around. Yeah. That's people. That's people for you. Aren't people lovely? One bag of noodles, that's it. That's all you're gonna buy. Here's your dollar change. Now get out of my store. Hello, sir. How are you doing today? I'm having a wonderful day. I'm not at all pissed off by the last customer. Couldn't find eggs, my ass. My ass, you couldn't find eggs. The amount of people still end up wrong every day made me lose faith in people. Yeah, like people that can't read. They don't know how to read a sign. Oh no, I need to turn the lights on. It's getting dark. Credit card. Have a nice day. Couldn't find a choco picky cereal. Oh, we're out. I was gonna say, bro, it's like right there. No, we ran out. My bad. I bought uh, a, a food, a product license, and then I spent all my money on that. So I couldn't buy a lot of choco cereal. Oops. My bad. What couldn't you find? Cheese. Okay, whatever. Oh, not exact change? Gross. But at least your change was easy. It was just a dollar. And ones is always what you'll have the most of. So I'm happy to give away ones. But when people are like, can I get my change back in ones? I'm like, yes. Thank you. Like, I want my change back in all ones. I'm like, yes, you are amazing. <laughs> Thank you. I have like a hundred ones in this drawer. Please take the ones. I have too many ones. Especially at like the end of the day. I'm like, take the ones. <laughs> But you gotta think they're going to the strip club, though. <laughs> you gotta think that. When they're like, can I get my change back of ones? I'm like, I know where you're going. I know what you bought these shoes for. <laughs> I know what you bought these heels. Okay. You're not fooling anybody. Okay. <laughs> no, I actually, I used to work at a clothing store. I had some, like, two ladies come in. Like, at clothes. Oh, exact change. Let's go. Came in at clothes. Shopped around forever at the freaking... Because we had underwear, right? We, it was a men's and women's clothing store. We had underwear. We had, like, lingerie, okay? They looked around at the thongs for a long time. Past clothes. Like, we were already closed. And then all they and then all they bought was thongs and heels. And that's it. And they're like, we're going to the strip club. I'm like, that's nice. <laughs> not that I've... No, I mean, like, you know, whatever, you know, people gotta make a living. I'm not, like, judging them. It's just like, like, I don't care if you're a stripper. Like, it's not a big deal. Like, who cares? Like, you're making money. As long as you're happy, it's not like a... Not anything to be, like, to judge somebody about. It was how they, like, came in right at club. This is what pissed me off. I didn't care. Like, they could have been, like, firemen. And they could have been like, we're buying this to fight fires in. And I would have been just as pissed off. Because, like... Wait, did you hand me a change or a card? Oh, you hand me a card. Okay. Um, I was like, what's happening? I don't see a card in the machine. They came in right at close, and then they were in there forever, for like a long time past close. And then they were so giddy about, they were just like, eh, we're buying this for the strip club. And I was like, I don't care what you're buying this for. You're in my store way past close. I want to go home. Like, it could have been an astronaut, and he could have been like, I'm buying this, this thong to wear into space. I'm like, bro, you could, I don't, like, that doesn't interest me. Like, you could literally be telling me the truth, and you're about to wear this pe like this thong into space. And somebody else might think that's, like, the coolest shit ever. And I'm like, bro, I actually don't care at all. I want to go home. Like, leave. Go away. <laughs> oh, it's closing time. They could be like, I'm, I'm Taylor Swift's daughter, and I'm buying this to... For the wear backstage at the next con, I'm like, bro, I don't, I don't care. I'm like, go, get, leave the store, <laughs> get out of my store now. Uh, then there's the people who ask for something we don't have after looking at the menu every time. I was tempted to ask, well, do you fucking see it on the board? No. What do you think then? I don't know because some places be having secret menu items though. To be fair, and sometimes I, I actually can't find it on the menu, but it is on there. Like one time I was going to Taco Bell. I couldn't find this this type of burrito I wanted. It wasn't in the numbers. Like, you know how there's like a number one, a number two, a number three. It wasn't one of the numbers. It was like a chicken chalupa burrito or something. It's not on there. 
And like the burritos on there, but the meal isn't because there is such a thing as like a chicken chalupa meal. And it comes with a chicken chalupa burrito. It comes with a, uh, what's it called? What's that shit called? It's like a taco, but it's not. It's got a really thick shell. It's really good. What is that called? I don't know, but it comes with one of those. And it comes with a double stack taco. And it comes with chips and cheese and a drink. That's five items, and it's like $9 and some change. It's like the best meal you can get at Taco Bell. It's like the most items you can get in one meal. for the least. Because normally, a meal is like two items and a drink. Like three items total. You get like a burrito, a taco, and a drink. Or something like that. Like quesadilla, a taco, and a drink. No, this is a burrito, a double stack taco, not a regular, not even like a regular soft or hard taco. A double stack taco. And uh, what is it, a chalupa? I think it's a chalupa or something. It's like chicken quesadilla burrito. I don't know what it's called. Chicken something burrito. Double stack taco, chalupa, chips, and a uh, cheese, and a drink. That's five items. That's like five items for like nine dollars and change. it's amazing but it's not listed in the numbers like one two three four five six it's not on there and then like the burrito by itself is on there but it just listed as like an individual burrito you can buy it doesn't list like what you get if you order it as a meal what comes with it it's like not even on their drive through menu but it's like the best thing on their the best thing that you can order anyway <laughs> but i digress okay purchase a fridge or shelf okay i can purchase this fridge for 200 and still have 70 so I'm going to do that. I'm going to still have 70 to buy product. Ooh, look at this big boy box. Look at this big box. Okay, how do I place this shit in here? Okay. Where do I want to put this? Do I want to put this, like, in the corner? Like, right here? But there's not, like, a lot of spacing. I want to keep, like, even spacing. Let's see how that's got, like, a good amount of space. I want to put, like, even, like that. That's good. I like that. Nice and even, Steven. Okay, let's buy at least something cold. But we can't buy a lot of cold stuff because it's kind of expensive and I only have $70. So let's go... What's the cheapest cold thing? Let's see, we have cheese. That's Oh, cheese is only $1.79. Oh, damn. I mean, the eggs are kind of a lot. Oh, milk is cheap. Okay, let's get one of... Oh, no, that's the unit price. Okay, I wasn't looking at the... Okay, total price still isn't bad. So we'll buy one of those, one of those. And then we'll get more of this cheap shit over here. Man, the, the cereal is expensive, bro. I can't even afford the cereal right now. Like, I can't even afford it. That's like all my money right here. It's like... Oh shit, that's more money than I have. Damn, because of tax. Because of tax! We didn't have anything that was available not on the giant board. Uh, some places do, though. Like, how does the customer know? You know what I mean? Like, they don't know. Like, some places do. And, like, some places even have secret menu, like... Um... The fucking, uh... What is it? Is it In-N-Out? I think it's In-N-Out. It has, like, secret menu on it. And then, like... Sometimes there'll be a, a thing that was on the menu... They'll take it off the menu, but they'll still make it for you if you ask for it. Because they still have the ingredients for it. Like, there was a coffee shop that sold this one type of coffee. It was like lemonade and, and coffee mixed together. And they stopped, they took it off the menu, but they still had lemonade and coffee. So, like, they could still make it. They still sold the thing separately. So, like, you could go there and order it, and they would still give it to you. So, like, I don't know. She could have thought it was something like that. Like, that kind of situation. What do I have stuff of already? That I don't need to order. I have oil. Did I order oil? I don't think I even ordered oil, though. Did I try and order oil? I don't think I did. Damn. Okay. I still have a little bit of susu, so I guess I'll take that off. Purchase that. Bro, every time we make money, we end up spending it. So it's like, it's not really... We're not making a lot of product... I mean, we did get a, a product license. And we did get a cooler. So I guess slowly but surely... We're leveling up the place, right? But it's slow. It's slow. Okay, let's get, ditch all of those. Um, what is this? The flower? Okay. Where have I been putting that? Right here. Ditch all of the flower. I'm not going to have a lot of products in here today. But the customers will be like, I couldn't find anything. I couldn't find my usual... My usual choco chippy cereal. 
Where's my Choco Chippies at? Oh my god, I'm so upset. I'm so entitled and my Choco Chippies aren't in here. And that makes me mad. How dare they not have my Choco Chippies? How dare they? There's not a lot of space in this freezer fridge thing. Not a lot. Not a lot in the little fridge, but that's okay. Okay. 240. Oh, did we sell a lot of the. Oh, bro, we didn't sell this shit at all. Oh, wait, yes, we did. <laughs> I thought. I just refilled it. <laughs> I thought, oh my god, we didn't sell any of these. Wow, they must not have wanted to spend more of the market. No, we sold all of it. I'm so stupid. So we can go a little bit higher. So 240, let's go three. Let's make everything even. Let's just round everything up and see how that goes. So we got 340, so we'll go $4. We'll round it up even if it's under 50 cents. We won't round down at all. We'll only round up and see how that see how that goes for us. The $4, not much of an increase, but hey. Maybe we can go 450, you know. Cuz $4 is just like a few more cents. Um yeah, we'll go we'll keep this one 4. Keep this one $4. And then 450, so we're going to go 5 on that. It just frustrated me to no end. Some things I can get. I mean, I, I can understand being frustrated with the customer for sure. But sometimes, though, I'm like, well, I'm also a customer too sometimes. And sometimes I do these things. So and sometimes I got to be like, well, you know, they don't know, you know, like there's some things they just don't know because they don't work there. So I got to like, I got to let it, I got to let it go sometimes, you know, it just depends on the situation. Yo, Miss Cloudberry Castle Day Care Show. What an awesome name. Thank you so much for coming to the stream. Thank you, thank you. How are you doing on this wonderful day? Aloha. Aloha. Bro, that reminds me of that new Yakuza game that's set in Hawaii. There's like a... Is it a DLC where they go to Hawaii? Or is the whole game set in Hawaii? I don't know. But there's a VTuber who has a, uh, a part in the game. She has like an actual character in the game. They like they put they modeled it after her real life like face and everything, and she voices the character, and the, and she says aloha the way she says like aloha, aloha. I can't do it. I can't do it how she does it. I wish I could. I wish I could imitate it. What does it say? You purchase a new section using your computer, bro. That's gonna be a while. How much does that cost? That's gonna be a minute. Where do I do that? Growth, three hundred and fifty. Okay, that's not as bad as I thought. Yo, Chase, welcome back. It's been a minute. I guess it hasn't been that long. It's only been like a couple of days. I don't remember. I don't, did I see you yesterday? I did see you yesterday, didn't I? On a Yu-Gi-Oh. I think I did. I think you were here. I don't know why I thought you were. It's been a couple of days. It hasn't. Forgive me. Forgive me, Chase. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for coming. How are you doing on this wonderful day? I now require $350 to expand my store 4x4 four four meters. I think we can do it. It might take a couple of days of being open before we can do it. Eventually we're gonna hire some people um, and get some get some workers in here so that I can not have to not have to stand here and scan all this stuff. But look we got a cooler now. We got milk and cheese. Isn't that so nice? No you weren't here yesterday? Okay I don't know why I thought you were here yesterday. Oh, the storm! Okay, I remember the storm. Yes, I remember. Glad you, you've you made it. You survived the storm. We've been having storms here, too. It's been, it sucks, man. I hate it. I hate this time of the year when we get storms all the time. Good thing it was not a warning. Yeah, it was just a watch, right? Just a tornado. I remember you were like, my phone's about to die. You were having a tornado watch. You're like, my phone's about to die. I'm like, bro, get off of the stream, bro. You need to save the... You gotta save your, your phone battery so you can check the weather alerts. You gotta know if you're gonna have a warning. Because if the power goes out and you can't check the TV and you have like a tornado warning, you won't even know it. You won't even know about it. I remember that. I'm glad I'm glad everything worked out. Yeah, this time of the... Oh, look. See what I say. Choco Peaky cereal. Everyone's gonna be mad about it. But it's expensive. It cost me like 35 bucks just for one unit. Which is like, what? Eight boxes or something? It costs so much for just like eight boxes of cereal. I can't afford it, bro. I just brought a fridge. 
I just bought a fridge. I can't afford Choco Piki. Not working the register at my job was better. I like working the grill. Yeah, I never had to work where I... I never had to cook anything. I was about to say I never had to work at like a restaurant. That's not true. I did, but I didn't have to cook anything. Uh, but I mostly worked retail. That was like clothing. A lot of a lot of various clothing stores was most of my retail. I only did one restaurant, and it wasn't fast. It wasn't fast food. It was like a sit down restaurant, uh, like a bar and everything. 87, okay, 50, 60, 70, 85, 86, 87, there you go. Couldn't find coffee dark roast? We've never even sold that here, sir. You're complaining about an item that, pasta is too expensive, oh shit. Okay, I gotta turn turn the price down on the pasta. Bro, he's complaining we don't have coffee. We don't serve coffee here, okay? We never have had coffee in the store. Why are you complaining at me? Don't you dare. Don't even start with me, bro. I will throw... I will I will jump across this counter right now. Don't think I won't. Don't think this counter is protecting you. Don't think you're safe just because you're on the other side. I will hop right over this counter right now. Okay? And I'm not playing. I'm not even playing, bro. I wanted to watch you play, you man, though, but then it was a good idea. <laughs> Are you playing a shopping game? No, I'm playing a store management game. It's like Supermarket Simulator. Where you have to like run your store and like you upgrade stuff. Couldn't find tea. We never serve tea. How dare you? 92? Man, you guys need a lot. Man, look at all the change you just took from me. This is all my change. You just took all my change, bro. How? Why? Don't you have any smaller bills? Bro, we are so low on product. I might need to start buying product throughout the day. But, like, to try to buy a product and then stock it and then work the register. Okay, let me buy Choco Piki. Let me buy some Choco Piki because everybody wants that. I don't want to buy too much stuff because I need money to expand the store. And, look, I'm not even going to get a, a chance to, like, go out there and, and stock it. Okay, let's hurry up. Bring the box in here. Oh, my God, I'm sorry. Drop the box. How do I drop it? Throw? Okay. Can't throw here? Okay, okay. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry about your weight, ma'am. That'll never happen again. Please forgive me. 2040, 1, 2. Have a nice day. Hello, welcome to supermarket. Did you find everything you needed? Thank you so much for shopping with us. Can I interest you in any additional items today? Do you have any coupons? Get the hell out of my store. Never come back here ever again. How dare you complain to me. Choco Piki. Here's your precious Choco Piki, everybody. That you all love. I think I need to do the price down on the pasta. No, I don't. That one guy complained about the pasta price, but look how well it's selling. Look how well it's selling. And that guy was complaining. That's fine. I don't need you to buy it because other people will buy it. It doesn't even matter if you don't buy it because you think it's too expensive. Because literally I'm going to sell out of it anyway. And I'm going to make like more money for it. He couldn't find oil. What the hell? Let's round this up to a nice $6. You know what? Let's go ahead and make it a six twenty-five. People love this shit. They'll pay for it. They're addicted to this, bro. I think they're using addictive, like, substances in this. Bro, there's expiration dates on this. And it's actually, like, yo, the expiration dates make sense for the current time. Look at the expired. It expires in the fifth month. What is that, May? January, February, March, April, May? I had to count it on my fingers. It expires May 22nd of this year. That's so cool. That's so cool that it actually works with, like, the real dates of, like, the real life. That's sick, bro. $12. Nice. Have a nice day. Uh, the absolute worst, though, was when people would come in during a rush. It would be, like, two people ordering for themselves. They would each take five minutes to order a burger and fries. Yeah, because they have to decide. That's why I'm like, if I have to decide what I want... I still haven't decided. I'll I'll figure it out in the car. Like I'll pull up the menu on my phone and figure it out in the car before I go in. I won't stand in there and wait. Or if I do go in and wait to decide, like if I if I don't know what I want, I'll stand back. I'll stand far away from the counter and look up at the sign. I won't like approach the counter and then be like, oh hold on, I'm still figuring it out. But like no, there's you're holding up the line. There's people behind you. Like no. Like stand off to the side and figure it out. Let the other people go in order. Bro said, don't you come back to the store. Yeah, bro. If these people complain, I'm like, never come back here again. How dare you? How dare you? 
complain at me. This is my store. If you don't like this store, open your own store. And then you can run it however you want. However you want. Like, or go to another store. Like, you don't have to shop here, bro. I don't need your business. Like, I got plenty of business, okay? People, look at, I sold all the pasta noodles. Even though I'm upcharging. Even though I'm selling them at, like, ridiculous prices. I still sold out of all of them. It's like, do you think I need your business? No. If you don't buy it, somebody will. Don't think that I need your business. Customers are really entitled, like, well, you won't give me this item for free? Oh my gosh, I deserve, you should discount this, like, is this on any sale? Like, no, it's full price. Can't you just give me, like, 50% off or make it clearance? Or ch I'm like, no, I can't do that. Like, oh, come on, I shop here all the time. Like, I can't give it to you on 50% off, man. It's the price that it is. There's no haggling here. This is a corporate, it's a corporation I'm not the store owner, it's not like a family run business and I'm the person that orders all the shit and decides the prices. It's like a corporate store, bro. You have to pay for what it, the price is, I can't make it half off. They're like, well, you will be losing my business, sir. I'm like, first of all, I don't give a fuck, it's not my business. I'm collecting a paycheck either way, it's a corporation, they have to pay me, whether they make their sales or not. If they go under, I'll just, it's a retail job, bro, I'll get another cashier job anywhere in this whole mall. I can get, I'm walking to any other store in this mall and get a job today. You think I care? If we lose your business, I don't care. Also, uh, we do so much business anyway, like, it doesn't matter. Like, we, you, we losing one customer is like, it doesn't matter, bro. Like, it's not gonna affect us at all. Not even a little bit. Like, you crazy. You're like, oh, well, you have lost my business, sir. Well, I lost money today. Why did I lose money? How did I lose money? It's because of my bills. Bro, I haven't been checking the bills. I bet I'm paying a lot in bills. Oh, shit. Oh, these are cheap. These are really cheap. Let's pay that. Oh, no. I'm, I'm behind on the rent. Oh, shit. Okay. I wasn't checking the bills, bro. Okay, this today, I can't buy a new section. I don't even think I have enough anyway. I don't. Even if I did, it would be all my money and I couldn't do that. Meanwhile, the line got longer and people were waiting for like 15 minutes. It's like y'all had 10 minutes in line to look at the menu and decide. I wish we could have sent them to the back. I know, right? Like, why are you getting in line when you haven't decided yet? Like, like stand back. Let other people go in order while you're waiting. And like, stand away from the counter. Stand off to the side or to the back. Like, let other people in front of you in order if you haven't figured. Don't stand there for 10 minutes trying to think, figure it out while you're... Like, people are so crazy, bro. It makes no sense. Who shops late at 9? People do, man. People will be running into the store last minute before close. I want to speak to your manager. Ha! Huh. Turns around, does a 360. I am the manager. <laughs> what can I do for you, bitch? This is my store. <laughs> nah, I'm playing. Okay. Let's see. Do I have enough choco? I think I have plenty of choco left. You have plenty of choco. I have plenty of milk, so I don't need... I don't need any more milk or choco. I think I should get some more shiz. For sure. I need coffee if I can afford it, but it's so expensive, bro. Look how expensive it is. I'm gonna get bottled water. I would get eggs, but I don't have enough room for it. Then I'm gonna get bread, flour, sugar, pasta, and oil. And then I think I'm gonna I think that's gonna do me. Because look, I only have $27 left. Dude, it fell over. That is a safety hazard. It, what if this fell on this poor lady walking past and this fell on her and hit her in the head? A big box of oil like this would have been heavy. That could have injured somebody. Well, I'm going to file a complaint with the delivery company. They are unprofessional. No, that's the manager. The store sucks. Runs away. I'm never coming here again. You just lost my bit. And I'm going to leave a bad review on Yelp. Like, that's funny. You think people still use Yelp? I'm like, have you ever heard of Google reviews? You, really? You're going to leave a bad review on Yelp? Really? You think anyone's going to read that? That's cute. You ever heard of Google? You know, like, that's a thing. Okay. <laughs> but I love how this game, that me playing this game is just reminiscing about all my horrific nightmares of, like, working in retail. <laughs> I'm getting like PTSD, bro. It's kind of stressful. <laughs> I 
I don't know what else to talk about though while playing this. There's not really a lot to do. We're kind of just like like a job simulator right now. We're like doing a fake job right here. So it's kind of like there's not really a lot of stuff to talk about. Oh, we got water. Water sucks. It really, really sucks. Oh, this has to go in a fridge. Oh, damn it. I got cheese too, bro. That is not all going to fit. Okay, let me drop it. Let me put... Because this is more water than I have cheese. Let me fill it with cheese first. Let me do cheese first. And then let's see how much water I can get in here. Maybe I can fit all the water. Maybe. I don't think I can, though. We'll see. Oh, it actually puts a lot of water in there. Okay. Oh, nice. I didn't know I would have enough room for all three. Let's go. Let me check the prices. Okay, three. That's still good. Okay, we didn't sell a lot of milk. So I need to make that go down a little. Let's go to 75. Okay. Because I didn't sell a whole lot of that. Cheese I did sell. We'll leave that at four. Water. Market price is 266. I think an even three is good. We sold all of that. All this stuff is selling really well. Let me just check and make sure the market price hasn't changed like crazy drastically. No, that seems pretty like the same. Okay, yeah, that's good. Um, oil, yep, yep, yep. The choco thingies. We didn't sell a lot of these, did we? But it, we we didn't up the price that much. We didn't up the price that much. Should I lower the price on choco things? Let's go six. 15 okay these sold well we'll leave that i think right okay hopefully we sell a lot today let's have the store meeting everyone gather around okay we got to make our goal today our goal we want to expand we want to expand the store so to do that we need at least um 350 dollars and then we also need a solid like 70 80 dollars for Hey, let's, let's just call it a cool 450. Today's sales goal is 450. Uh, let's just all work really hard. Don't forget to like upsell the customer and like try and basically force them to buy more. Don't take no for an answer. Really harass them at the register if they're like, nah, this is all I need. Like, but don't. Are you sure? Don't you really need like some water? But you could use some water, right? No, I don't need water. But like, you could though, right? Now, like, make sure to do all that and really piss them off so they'll never come back here ever again. Um, yeah, let's have a good day, guys. Go team. I love how I'm having a meeting by myself. That's crazy. I've lost my mind. <laughs> this is what retail does to you, man. It makes you go crazy. The worst customers were the high school sports teams because they would be like 20 people. Oh, dude, that's terrible. Coming in like 30 minutes before close and then not leave until 15 after, then they would trash the place. Bro, you're lucky they don't stay in there for like an hour because they, bro, they be just having a party in the, bro, and like a travel bus. Like a travel bus stops and it's like 30 people getting off the bus and all going into like the freaking Wendy's. Like, bro, I was in a Wendy's one time. I could not get back to my table. I was, I went to the drink machine to get a drink. A travel bus came in. All at the same time, it was like 30 people. Formed a big group that went from the register all the way to the door, cutting me off. I'm like stuck at the drink fountain. I can't even get, they wouldn't even let me through. I'm like... I had to push my, I had to like basically shove them out of the way. They would not move. I'm like, bro, my table's over there. I can't even get like through here. Bro, thank goodness it didn't work. Which was the last time you played Monster Hunter and which quest you on? Um, I don't remember. You can go back through my live streams and, and check that though. Like if you just go to my uh, like live, like if you go to my channel and then you click on like live. Uh... You can see when the last time I played was. I don't remember what quest I was on either. That's a good question. What quest was I on? I don't remember. You can check the last stream and see though. I really cannot remember for to save my life. I really couldn't tell you. I can't. My memory's so bad, man. My memory is garbo. Garbo memory. I love how we have infinite change. We never need to go to the bank. You need a cashier is the achievement I just unlocked. Completed a 100 checkouts. Yeah, I do need a cashier for real, but I have to I have to expand the store before I can do that Bro, it would be awesome if I could like really up char like upcharge these prices 
and they would still buy them. Like if I could sell milk for like a hundred dollars a thing, and and if it was, if the game was just broken, and they would just buy it anyway, because it's still in like early access, bro. If I could do that, that'd be great. We could make like infinite money, but I can't do. It. They won't buy it. They'll be like, this is too expensive. The game is already too fleshed out to to do it to exploit it. Man, I'm feeling really hungry all of a sudden. Like, I think staring at all this food has got me thinking about food. Bro, I need to, like... I have some Uncrustables, bro. I, after the store closes, I might, like, grab an Uncrustable. <laughs> I, I love Uncrustables, man. Love them. I got, like, the Nutella ones. With, like, the hazelnut chocolate spread. So good. I also really like the strawberry ones. Classic Grape is a good, too. You can't beat it. You can't beat the classic original. So good. Yeah, and I have some, like, I have some, like, flavored water I could be, I could drink. I also have some beer. I still have Guinness left over from St. Patty's Day. And some Samuel Adams cherry. I might grab one of those. I might. I probably won't, though. I'll probably just gra grab a flavored water. I need to drink more water. Today I only had, like, bubble tea. Well, I did have iced tea. I had some sweet tea, and then I had bubble tea. But I don't think I had water today yet. I normally I drink water like every day and I haven't today yet. I do need to drink water, so I'm gonna drink water. Stay hydrated, folks. Always stay hydrated. Bro, we're not making our sales goal, people. Pick up the pace. We're only at 191. The only travel bus we ever had was before I started. My friend was working that day. It was apparently all the roadies for the Doobie Brothers. I didn't even know they're still touring. Yeah, me neither. I didn't know any of the members were still alive either. Yeah, I did not know they were still tour. Look crazy though. The groupies for the Doobie Brothers tour. Coming into the to the fast food restaurant. Right at close. Like 50 people. What a what a great job. And back when we we didn't make a lot working in these type of jobs, man. We were making like chump change, man. I'm talking like seven twenty-five, maybe like nine dollars an hour if you're like lucky back then. Of course, all the everything's gone up now, so like a lot of the stores or retail stores and fast food and stuff is paying a lot more for minimum wage than they used to. But they kind of have to because all the prices of everything's gone up, so it kind of evens out, you know, kind of balances out. Bro, we're selling a lot of product, which is good. I'm not selling a lot of bread, though. Water, I'm not selling at all. Let's go 275 on the water. I haven't sold a single water. I should probably change the bread, too. Oh, I need to turn the light on. I'll be waiting to turn those lights on until it gets dark. Bro, I'm saving on my electricity bill. Couldn't find the coffee, bro. Coffee is like, too expensive, bro. Okay, let's do 425 on these. these. People are not buying that. See, I changed the price of water and I'm already... And bread. Bro, as soon as I changed the price and now people are buying it. See, I just need to pay more attention to the price. You can go too... You can go a little higher over the market price, but like... You can't go too much higher over it or they won't buy it. Stingy ass people. If you could choose one thing, anything you want, what would it be? You mean like as a physical item? Like if I could have any product from like any store for free? Or do you just mean like anything? Like a skill or an ability or to travel or like to be in a certain place? Or like, If I could wish for anything, I'd wish for immortality. <laughs> but if that's not on the table, then I'd wish to be fluent in Japanese like immediately right now. I just fluent in Japanese, like, I don't have to study it anymore. I just snap my fingers, bam, I'm like native Japanese level. I would wish for that. But if you're talking like a physical item that you can buy at a store, then I don't know. I don't know. I guess just like the most expensive computer that you can get at Best Buy or something. <laughs> That's what I would pick, probably. Or, you know what I would pick? 
I would pick a really expensive car, like a crazy, like a supercar that's like crazy expensive, right? I'm talking something that's like some supercar that costs like a million dollars. I'd pick that, then I'd sell it. I'd take the money, I'd take the million dollars from the supercar that I sold, put it into a savings account, then go to Best Buy, buy the most expensive computer they have, and then put the rest in the savings and let it earn interest. That's what I would do. Do you sell Doritos? I don't. I wish I did. I wish I sold Doritos and Mountain Dew. Sir, it's closed. We're closed now. Um, you're kind of an asshole. Never come in here past closed ever again. Okay? Or I will ban you from the store. Okay. Closing time. Oh, we earned $201. Okay, only half of our sales goal. Okay. We can't. Oh, profit, 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 blah, blah, blah. market prices went down, so I gotta change things. The problem is that minimum wage used to be the minimum to be able to live, but federal minimum wage is not increased to match the right rise in prices. I'm William Afton. I always come back. What does that mean? Purchase a new section. Okay, I can't do that yet. Because I won't have any money for product. Yeah, I don't even have enough money to purchase a new section. I probably have bills, too. I do. Pay my bills. See, we're going to have to go a couple more days before we... What did I have typed into the search bar? Alright, what did we not need? What do we not need? We don't need bread. We're good on that. Um, I don't need water. I can pretty much use anything else, though, besides bread. Not cheese, though, because then I won't have enough to put in the fridge. I won't have enough room. So not cheese, not water, not bread. No cheese, water, or bread. No cheese, no water, and no bread. I need these for sure. They sell too well. Give me one of this, one of this, one of this, one of this. No cheese, no water. I can't buy, uh, I could buy coffee, but it's so expensive. Okay, I can do milk. Should I go ahead and do coffee? I guess I should, huh? I'll do it. And that's it. Look how much that costs, bro. That that really costs a lot of money. Hopefully after this night, um, we can have enough to expand the store. I think we probably can. It's from F FNAF. Oh. Which one? I never really played F uh, FNAF or like any of the Five Nights games. I don't think. Maybe a long time ago I played like one or two. Like on mobile. Wasn't there one on mobile? I feel like I had one on mobile. I don't know which one it was. It was like one or two. I don't know. It was probably one, honestly. I, think I played one on mobile. I don't know. Oh, the display is full, is it? Well, I'll just put these extras down here then. But yeah. I don't know a lot about it. I did see the movie. Saw the movie. It was interesting. It wasn't like complete garbage, but it wasn't good. It was just meh. It was like okay, I guess. It was like eh. It was like eh. Alright, I guess. It was like eh. Yeah, it was a movie. Didn't hate it. I'll probably never watch it again. It was just like, eh. Like, it was something. It was like a movie. I don't know. I wasn't super into it. I could see that if some people liked it, I could see it. But, like, it wasn't for me. Just put it that way. It was just okay. They had me in the first half, though. At first, I was like, okay, Five Nights, okay. I was like, alright. And then about halfway through, I was like, wait, what? I was like, what's... This is kind of weird what's happening. And by the end of the movie, I was like, okay, this doesn't make any fun. I was like, this doesn't make sense, brother. What the hell is going on in this movie? This shit don't make any sense. They lost me in the second half, man. They had me in the first half, not going to lie. 275 I think that's still reasonable. Four do oh, that's way too much. Okay, we need to go like 325 Maximum. Okay, water. Okay, that's still reasonable. Oh, we need to put this down like 325. Um, bread 425 is still good. Flour four dollars is still good. Oil okay, that's still fine. Cereal good there. This cereal. Oh wait, is this even cereal or no? I don't even know. That's just powdered sugar. I don't even think that's cereal. Yo, hi cat. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Thank you. How are you doing today? Yo, this coffee sells for 1048. Let's sell it for 11 even. I think that'll help people buy that. Uh, count. 
Finally caught up with the stream. Yo, what's up, man? Thank you for coming. Okay, so I think we're good. $143 we have right now. I think after today we might be able to expand. Maybe. Cause you gotta remember, we gotta have we gotta have enough money to do pro to make to so we have to have we have to have the 350 to do, expand, but we also need money on top of that to buy product for the next day. So if we only had 350, it wouldn't be enough. We need like we need like at least like 450, I think, to be able to buy it, to expand, and then like have product for the next day. You know. Oh, I meant to get my encrustable and something to drink, and I forgot. Okay, after this day, I have got to do that because I'm like so hungry right now. I mean, I had hamburgers earlier and fries, but that was like several hours ago. And now I'm hungry. <laughs> and my stomach is a rumbly. Two things of oil. Do you really need two, though? Like, do you really need two? It seems excessive. Like, you're not going to go through oil that fast, okay? What are you playing tomorrow? What is tomorrow? Is tomorrow Wednesday or Tuesday? No, today's Tuesday. Wait, no. Is today Tuesday? Is today Tuesday? I don't remember what day it is. Uncountable the best? <laughs> uh, I, I got Uncrustable, right? Uncrustable? <laughs> yeah, Uncrustable is so good. I have the hazelnut ones. The chocolate hazelnut that's like Nutella, and I also have the strawberry ones. What day is today, bro? I don't even know what day it is. We'll see. Sunday we played the Leprechaun game. Monday we played Yu-Gi-Oh! And that was yesterday, so it must be Tuesday. Which means Wednesday... Okay, so I had scheduled... Um... Overwatch. Uh... For tomorrow. Um, I'm trying to set up a collab. Well, not really a collab. I'm trying to I'm trying to get uh, somebody else to play that with me on stream. Um, I'm trying to set a collab up. So like, depending on when they're free. So if they can do it tomorrow, then we'll we'll we'll, we'll go. Oh, look at all this coffee they bought. Thank you. This is gonna be a good a good sale. Forty two dollars. Hell yeah, that's a good sale, my man. Anyway. If they're able to do it tomorrow, then we're going to do that tomorrow as planned. I might have to switch, though, tomorrow stream and Thursday stream. You know what I mean? If they can't do it tomorrow, then they can do it Thursday. So we're going to switch. So depending on... I'm still waiting to hear back for them. So depending on like when they're available, we'll either do Overwatch tomorrow or we'll do Overwatch Thursday. And we'll swap whatever we had for Thursday for when, for tomorrow. What was Thursday? What did I have planned for Thursday? What? I think Sifu was Thursday. I think. I think I had planned Sifu. So if that's the case, then we would do Sifu tomorrow if I had to flip it. So it should either be Overwatch or Sifu. I don't remember if I had Sifu planned for Thursday. Though. I can't remember. Can't remember. Bro doesn't even know what day it is. It's hopeless. Yeah, bro. I, I'm lost, bro. I don't even know what day it is, to be honest. It's bad. It's really bad. No, it makes sense that it's Tuesday because I didn't have any. I didn't have to do any schoolwork today. So yeah, obviously I should have known that immediately. I didn't do any homework today. Like obviously it's Tuesday. If it was Monday, I would have been doing homework. If it was Wednesday, I'd have been doing homework. It's obviously Tuesday. Like why did I? What is your goal of subs? As many as possible. <laughs> I will never stop wanting to grow this channel. I don't know. They're probably at some point you like. It doesn't matter anymore, right? Like, I feel like PewDiePie, like, once he got to, like, 100 million, he's got to be thinking, like, okay, like, do I really need to keep, like, do I really need more, you know? Like, I, like if I had 100 million subs at that point, I don't think I'd be that concerned about growing my channel. I think I'd be satisfied. I'd be like, I'm good. Honestly, if I got a million subscribers, I would be good. Like, just one million. I'd be like, hey, bro, I'm good. Like, obviously, there's a lot of people with way more than that now. Like, back in the day, one million on YouTube, like, that was the goal. That was peak. Like, you had 1 million, you won YouTube. Like, you won. 
But now people be having like 20 million and still be like niche channel. Like there be channels with 100 million, like 50 million, like bro, like it's just crazy now. Like 1 million in the day used to be considered like, oh, you were well known. 1 million now is like, there's like a lot of channels with 1 million. It's like not even like a big, it's like niche. Like if you got 1 million, you're still niche. But I would be fine. I don't care. I would be like, one million, bro, I'm good. Like, I'm fine. Like, I don't need to grow it anymore. Like, I'll be happy if it continues to grow past that. But, like, I'm, 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 I'll be satisfied. You deserve 500 million? Aw, thank you. Oh, I gotta turn on the light. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Thank you, I appreciate it. Maybe one day. But no, honestly, like, realistically, I don't think I'm ever gonna have that many subscribers. I highly doubt it. I doubt I'll ever see like 10,000 to be, to be for real. Bro, I'll be lucky if I see a thousand. Like, let's just be honest. I'll be lucky to see a thousand. No, my goal for the end of this year is 500. If I could reach five, my, my realistic goal, if I could reach 500 by the end of this year, I would be really happy. Like, like I didn't even think, like, bro, when I started, okay, so, like, when I started streaming every day, or, like, nearly every day, six days a week is how often I stream, um, I was at 350, and I had been stuck, I had been making videos, but not streaming, just making, like, videos, and I had been stuck in, like, the mid-300s for a long time, but I did not expect to get to 400 when I started streaming in January, in the big, like, January 1st. The first week of January? I think it was January 1st. It was in the first week of January. I think it was January 1st. When I started streaming six days a week. Like, I did not expect to get to 400. Like, in the amount of time that I did. And now we're at, like, 477. I'm like, oh, shit. Okay, hold up. We're 476 now, I think. The last time I checked. And I'm like, I'm like, damn, okay. Like, maybe I can get to 500 this year. If I keep going, maybe I will get to 500. I don't know. I think it's a realistic goal. Before I didn't, before I started streaming, I wouldn't have even considered that a realistic goal, because I was stuck in like the mid three hundreds for so long. I would think like, oh, five hundred, no way, impossible. It's never gonna happen. But now I'm like, oh shit, maybe I can. Don't say that you'll reach anything. Ah, uh, you're too nice. You're too nice. But yeah, now I'm like, oh shit, maybe I can read. Oh bro, we're closed. It's nine o'clock. Okay, fine. Bro, look how much money we made. We can totally expand the store. Did you just put that in your purse? No, I'm just playing. <laughs> bro, I saw you slip that in your purse. No, I'm just playing. That's not a purse. That's like a shopping bag. I'm just being silly. Bro, trying to trying to deal with theft, do in the retail environment. Oh my god, bro. You have to be ever vigilant. Like you like. It doesn't matter. It could be like the sweetest old lady. They'll still steal. Like, it could be anybody. You can't trust anybody. But yeah. I was here around 360 or 370. Yeah, you were here from like the beginning of when I started to stream on like a six day a week basis. Like when I shifted, maybe not the first week or the second week. Because I think the first week I was streaming around like one. I was testing different times zone, I think. Oh, I don't know. I don't remember exactly how it went. But I know I was, like, I was streaming around 1 p.m. for the first bit. And then I was, then I started a little later. But then when I, once I switched to, like, 9 o'clock, which was pretty early on, I think that's when you started showing up around then. If I, if I remember correctly. But, yeah, that was probably around 360 or so. That was the beginning of January, like, the first week in January when I started. I'm like, I'm going to stream every day. My New Year's resolution... I'm gonna grow the channel. I don't care what it takes. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna make content as much as possible. I'm gonna continue to make YouTube videos and stream on top of making like regular like short form videos and stuff. Like I'm gonna do it both and I'm gonna grow the channel. And like here we are, like it's growing slowly but surely. Like little by little it's growing. I mean it's only been like what three months? We're like the we're like halfway through the third month since I've started and we already have gained over a hundred subs. Since then, we went from 350 to what, four, what am I at, 470 something? So like, hey man, if I just keep going, then maybe, maybe it'll just keep going up. I don't know, that's what I hope. I mean, maybe it'll slow down or it'll stop one day, but I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep going. Because like, that would, that's like the dream, man. That's my main goal. 
It's like my main goal in life. <laughs> to, like, be able to stream for, like, a living. Not because I want the money, just because, like, I love playing video games. It's, like, the one thing I'm passionate about. It's the one thing I don't get tired of doing. But it's going to be really hard to work a full-time job and be streaming full-time on top. Like, stream every day and work a full-time job. And, like, try to have a family or something. Like, one day when I get older, if I want to get married and have kids and stuff. Like, of course, like, uh, that's, like, talking, like, way in the future. Like, years in the future. But, like, if I did do that, like, how am I going to do that and work full-time and stream? There's no way it's impossible. Like, the only way I could keep streaming all the time... Like, at a certain age, I'm gonna have to, it's gonna have to be my main source of income, or else I just won't be able to do it. Because I'll have to be so busy with work and, like, other life things. But, yeah. Uh, you tested 3 p.m. the second week I was watching? Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I remember testing different times. I was here when you fought Kulu Haku. I remember that, fighting the Kulu Haku. That was funny. Section 350. Let's go. I bought the section. Oh, damn, but look, it didn't... <laughs> it didn't move the shelves, so I have to move the shelves, okay? Can I carry the shelf with stuff on it? Oh, I can. That's convenient. Nice. Yeah, I don't know. I would like to be able to just... Be able to stream every day and not have to worry about, like, not having enough time for it. Not having enough time for other life things. So, like, if I can make this, like, my living, bro, that's, like, the best life I could live. That's, like, I'd be living my best life. So I just love video games, man. And all I want to do is play video games every day. That's all I want to do, bro. I don't feel like doing anything else. I just love it. It's the only thing I don't get burnt out on. Like, all my other hobbies, if I do it every day, I get burnt out. Ah, uh, memories. Yeah, the memories. Bro, the milk didn't sell that well. I don't know if I should make it cheaper. I mean, it's, like, it's sold, but, like, it didn't sell, you know what I mean? It's sold, but, like, it didn't sell. Um, okay, I, I guess I can buy whatever, because everything is pretty low. I have 227. So let's buy, definitely buy this Choco shit, because that's worth good, and, like, people like that. Let's get all the basic shit here. Okay, I've already had 100, so... Let's do bottled water, let's do cheese, bottled water, and coffee, and let's, let's end with that, let's, let's do that. We're down to 26, oh, what's the bills, oh shit, dude, I don't know, I don't want to take out a loan, I could take out a loan, but then I have to pay it back, so like, I don't want to rely on the loan, how do I get to my bills again, six dollars, I can pay that one, twenty dollars, bro, just barely, just barely paid my bills on time, bro, it's just like real life. I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm just playing. Bro, the boxes are out in the street. They're going to get ran over. Bro, I have to. Bro, that delivery man. Oh, my God, bro. I have to talk to his manager. I have to talk to his boss, bro. He is he is slacking, bro. He's slipping. He's slipping. Time keeps on slipping, slipping, slipping. Into the future. Time keeps on slipping, slipping, slipping. Into the future, I'm gonna fly like an eagle into the sea. Did I order two things of bread on accident? Fly like an eagle, let the spirit carry me. I wanna fly into the future. Bro, I haven't seen Space Jam in a really long time. <laughs> but like, I've been listening to the soundtrack. The Space Jams. Bro, every song on that soundtrack is a banger, bro. That's a great soundtrack, bro. What's that other one that's like... Everybody wants to be united. Wants to be and feel united. Oh. Can't stop, can't stop, won't stop to be. Can't stop, can't stop, can't stop to be. Bam, 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 bam. Everybody wants to be and feel united. Oh, oh, oh so good bro so good and then of course like welcome to the space jam all right everybody get up and do the jam now we don't have to come and do the space jam do your jam it's a jam at the space jam 
I hate that song, bro. Which one? Which one? Which one? You have... bro. I love all the songs, bro. This is nothing but bangers. I don't have any storage yet, so I have to just put this here. This looks so bad. No, I'm gonna put it behind the counter. The customers don't need to see the in the box with the product. Cause that looks really unprofessional. So you put it where they can't see it. That looks so bad just sitting there. Almost forgot one. Oh, I thought I was done. I had one more box. Oh, I put the the cereal where the coffee goes. I guess I can put it here. Okay, I need to adjust all the price. I need to check all the prices to make sure I don't have to adjust. Bro, that that is that that soundtrack, bro, is so good. Nothing but bangers, bro. Oh shit, this went up. Okay, so let's do three twenty five, three fifty. What do you think? 325? Fly Like an Eagle? It's just bland and boring. Oh, bro, I like this song. <laughs> bip, 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 bip. Alright. Uh, <laughs> uh, I won't sing it anymore, but I like this song. 325, that's still good. 11. Yep, that's still good. Bread. 425, good. $4 is good. Oh, I need to get my Uncrustable, bro. Don't let me forget. 615, yep. And five, yep, 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 yep. Okay, everything's looking good. Let me get my Uncrustable. Okay. Give me like two seconds and a water. My mini fridge is like in my room next to my computer. So I don't have to go to the kitchen to get snacks and drink. I know, it's terrible. What a lifestyle I live. Okay, hold on. But I do have to, my, 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 cord, my cord for my headset isn't long enough. So I have to actually take my headset off. And like step out of the frame of my camera, so my model will all get all straightened out and just do a death stare, just do like a blank stare and out in front of itself uh, for a second. So enjoy that. <laughs> Ow! I stubbed my toe. Oh man, do I want strawberry or the hazelnut? I think I'm gonna open the hazelnut. I have two unopened boxes in here, bro. Man, two unopened boxes of Uncrustables. How lucky am I? Like, I can't complain about anything. Ow. What did I just do? Oh, shit, I didn't know this was in here. Oh, man, that's probably not even good anymore. That's probably went bad. <laughs> Oh my god, I just realized I have yuzu thing, like yuzu sauce in my fridge. I <laughs> have like yuzu things in there. Would you stub that hurts? Yeah, my foot on the chair. But it wasn't that bad. And then I, I dropped my water bottle. Which landed on the shelf which has the yuzu thing, which knocked off the shelf, which made me realize that I still had that, bro. We got that a long time ago, man. That's probably no good anymore. I need to reset my model. Because it's going all crazy now. Okay, that should be good, I think. But this is so good. I, I decided on the hazelnut one. Oh, I better open the store, huh? The sign's over here now. Bro, one day, I'm gonna have enough footage of me eating Uncrustables on stream that we could do a, a compilation. Like a compilation of like <laughs> the moments of me eating Uncrustable on stream. Like, I can't wait till that becomes a thing. Wrecked. JK, hope you're okay. Yeah, I'm fine. It didn't even really hurt. I just kind of hit my foot on the chair a little bit. It didn't even really hurt. I'm just dramatic. So I can't help but say ow, even if it didn't really hurt that bad. I don't know I don't know why I'm like that. I'll say ow if I'm playing a video game. My character gets hurt in the game. I will audibly say ow out loud. Does anyone else do that? Yes, buy. Purchase more goods. I'm 38. I wonder if I can use my keypad to type this. Oh, I can. Nice. 
That's so much better than typing it. I mean, than clicking on it. That's so much better. It's just a natural response. I don't know. I mean, you're probably right, but like a lot of people don't do that, I think. I mean, it probably is a natural response, but like at the same time, I still think most more people, I think le I think most people don't do it. If that makes sense. I don't know if what I just said made any sense. I'm speaking nonsense over here. Bro, the store feels so much bigger, but as a result, feels a lot emptier because there's like no shelves hardly. I think it would have made more sense to like, I was just doing it in the order the game was telling me to do it. It would have made more sense to like buy shelves first and then expand it. Or like, unlock storage first and then buy shelves, and then put the shelves in storage until we could like expand it. I feel like that would have made more sense, dude, in that order. There's like no goal for me now. That was like the last goal it gave me was to expand the store. Now it's just like, okay, you're on your own. The next thing I wanna buy is a cashier. If I had a cashier, then I wouldn't have to do this, and then like, while they were doing this, I could be like replacing, I could like, if we ran out of a certain product off the shelf, I could order it and like fill it back up. Which would be really nice. I had an idea. Sorry, I was finishing my Incrustable. It's gone now. It was very good. I need to wash it down with some water. You know self-checkout machines? You put the money in, and it spits out exact change. What if they made a register? It wouldn't be a self-checkout. It would be like a normal register where a person runs it. However, when the customer hands the the money to the 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 ten, the tenin son, how the fuck do you say the the cashier? Oh my god, I'm forgetting English, bro. What the hell? It's really bad when you can't even remember words in your native language. The cashier. When the customer hands the money to the cashier, it could work like an a, like a, a, a self-checkout in the way that the, the cashier would just feed the cash in the machine, and then it would spit out the right change and then to the cashier, and then the cashier would give the change to the customer. That way, it would be impossible to give wrong change, like accidentally give too much change. Because, you know, sometimes two bills will be stuck together, like two 20s will be stuck together, and you you think you handed somebody one 20, but you give them two. Then you're in trouble because your drawer is $20 short at the end of the day. And then they think you got internal theft going on, like somebody probably stole it. And it's like, it was probably just stuck. You know, and then they're going to do an investigation, who's stealing 20s out of the drawer. You know what I'm saying? They could get rid of all that. Since they have the technology, obviously, they use it in the, the self-checkout. The rest of the machine would be the same, like the way you scan it. The buttons on the, like everything else about it would be exactly the same. Everything else about the cash register wouldn't change. Just instead of the money drawer, you would have like that part on a, on a self checkout where you just feed the money in and it would spit the money back out. And obviously you'd be able to open it just in case like it ran out of change and you needed to put more change in it or, or at the end of the night to, you know, take out the, the extra cash, the profit cash or whatever. And you know, you would just leave a certain amount in it for change, and you would take out like the extras. But like during the day, you wouldn't need to open it up, you would just feed in the money and it would spit money back out. And you wouldn't be able to give wrong change by accident. And then if the ATM, or not the ATM, the, the machine, the cashier, the cash register comes up short on cash, then you know somebody definitely stealing at that point. Well, unless they had a mount function, that could be bad because they might have an amount function and then. Bro, I'm right here. Did you ring that bell, bro? I see you, okay? I had to turn on the light. You want me to check you out in the dark? Impatient ass. Get that out of my store. As I was saying. Is that like a good idea or is that a horrible idea? 
Oh, that's a good sale. You brought a lot of stuff. And exact change. Oh, look at you. You're my favorite customer. Bro, I need more lights in here, bro. Look, there's no lights on like that side of the store. It's dark over there. Yeah, when I get hurt in game, the first word that comes out of my mouth is usually the F word. I'm going to go see you guys. Okay, have a good night. Thank you for coming to the stream. See you next time. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, what did I just do? Wait, what? Oh, she had no chance. I was about to give her $33, bro. I don't know why. I don't know why I was about to do that. I was about to just give it to her. She would have accepted it, too. She wouldn't have said nothing. She would have been like, oh, no, I didn't need... I gave you exact change. No, she'd be like, oh, thank you. <laughs> you know she would have. We need to buy a cash uh, buy. <laughs> we need to hire a cash uh, cashier before we before we uh, do anything else with money. The bread's not selling very well. I notice. Fifty cents. Maybe it just seems like that because I bought extra bread and I have two shelves instead of one shelf. I guess it's not selling any worse than like the cereal or or the, the oil. It's actually fine. It just seems like that because there's two shelves with bread. Oh, we're closed. Closing time. Oh my god, I lost money. But I have $416. How does that work? How much does it cost to hire somebody? Daily wage... Oh, I have to complete 200 checkouts before I can even hire the first guy. Daily wage 80, hiring cost 100. Oh man, dude. Steep. That's fine. I mean, we can afford it, but like, it's more than I thought. I also must go. Have a good night. Okay, no problem, man. Thank you for coming to the stream. See you next time. Alright, let's do... Do I need any more bread? I don't need any more bread, do I? I don't need any more bread. Can I move this? Oh, I can't use this box to like... Oh, yeah, okay. I wanted to move the bread up. Put it together. Okay, I don't need any more bread. Other than bread, I think... I can, I can order anything else. I just don't need to order bread. And, you know what? I don't need any more cereal for the time. So I don't need bread or chocolate cereal. But I can order this and 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 you know what I'm gonna order some tea and that's it and then maybe after this day I can hire a cashier I think I might be able to after this one look at my boxes on the street man we really gonna have to have a word with that delivery guy. The next, if I ever catch him, he's too fast. By the time I get out there, I place the order, I click order. By the time I get out of here, he's already dropped it off and gone. If I could just get out there quicker and catch him before he gets away, I'd be like, "Hey man, you, 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 you gotta quit leaving my shit all over the road. What the hell's wrong with you? I'm gonna cause an accident and damage my my goods. Can't be doing that shit, man." We're going to have issues. I like how that sounded just now. It was like a little melody. It had like a little rhythm to it, you know? I didn't mean to put that one there. That was a mistake. It's fine. So if I have a cashier, and then I run out of a certain good midday... Because like when I'm on the cash register, it's like constant customers. I hardly have time in between. I mean, I get a little bit of time in between... But not a lot, so like, if I had a cashier, then it would be really easy to like restock things in the middle of the day as they run out. So I think that would be really nice. Summertime and the living's easy. Oh shit, I have an extra thing. And I can't, oh bro, I can't leave this out, it's gonna go bad. But I don't really have a choice because I don't have enough room and if I do milk, I got milk here too, it's going to fill up the rest of the thing. I'm kind of screwed. Yeah, 
I'm kind of screwed up. Okay, as soon as somebody buys a cheese, I need to put that cheese in there so it doesn't go bad. Oh, is this the tea? This is the new item. Bro, I could have put it here, but I fucking... Aw, oh, man. Man. Okay. Damn it. I'm going to have to put it really low. Oh, well. I didn't want to put it that low, but that's fine. I can put a lot down there. Okay. Alright, let's check all these prices. That's still a good price, I think. Um, yeah, that's still good. Uh, I might want to change this to three. Yeah, that seems a little steep. Uh, that's good. Coffee. Yep, 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 yep. Bread. Yep, that's good. Looking good. That one's looking good. Okay, what's this one? 668. So let's go even seven on that. The black tea. That sounds good. Um, let's see. Five. Oh, we need to up this. We need to be like 525. Yeah. That's perfect. 615. Oh, that went down. In okay, we need to make this like an even five now. That went down. Um, okay, and this one is 556. Oh, this one needs to go up. This needs to be like an even six dollars. And, bro, well, imagine if grocery store prices really worked like this, where they change every day. I mean, I know they change prices. Like, they don't be changing, fluctuating up and down, up and down, like, on a daily basis. Imagine doing price changes in the store, that the prices actually fluctuated up and down like that every day. Bro, you'd be constantly making new tags, and, like, running out of tags. Bro, oh my god, it would be a nightmare. It'd be a nightmare. Alright, today, I think we'll make enough money to... Where we can hire a cashier. I think. And I hope. And I pray. Oh my god, does he pray? I pray every single day. Yeah. For a revolution. Um, I've been open for an hour and I haven't had any customers. That's not a good sign. Like, I could have opened a whole hour later. There was no point. That whole first hour of business was, like, w pointless. I need to hire somebody that stands outside with a sign. That spins the sign around to get people to come in. Like, promotions. We got this on sale. Come on in. We just lowered the price of Choco Peak. Choco Peaky or whatever it's called. On sale now for the low, low price of $5. Come on in. Get your choco peaky. Bro, somebody just grabbed a lot of cereal. I mean, not of uh, this stuff. What is it? Powder sugar. I keep thinking it's cereal, but it's not. Man, they, they bought four between themselves. Oh, that's a good sale. That's a good sale. Oh, shit, I did the wrong thing. Oops. See, if that was real life, I would have overcharged them a cent. But I wouldn't have said nothing about it. Because it's just one penny. And I'm not about to do a refund, a card refund for one penny. I'd just give him a penny out of the drawer. Or something. Summertime and the living's easy. Oh, look at all this coffee. The coffee, it gets a lot of profit. Um, two... Seventy-five. I just realized we have fifty cent coins. Is that real? Wait, is there actually such a thing? I know there's a dollar coin, so you can get dollar coins. Is there 50 cent coins? I don't know if I've ever seen one. I know I've seen dollar coins. Like, I know that for sure. Have I seen a 50 cent? Well, I know I wouldn't be keeping them in a drawer. Like, in a retail space. I wouldn't be having a drawer full of 50 cent coins. It wouldn't be like a regular thing, a regular thing you would keep in the drawer. Because nobody pays with them. Because nobody has them. Because they're like not something you use normally. <laughs> okay, we're doing good. We're, we're making some money. So far, so good. Summer time. Eggs, eight pack. Bro, I don't have enough refrigerator space, bro. Lay off. Get off my case. 
Come back when I have more money. Why don't you give me enough money to buy a thing then? Has anyone bought cheese yet? Can I put this in here? I can, okay. Has anyone bought water bottles? They have. Okay, I can fill that up, but like not yet. So I gotta check this guy out. I gotta check him out, bruh. Can't let the customers wait. Choco P, yeah, you like that sale, don't you? They're on sale right now. They're cheaper than they were yesterday. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Fifty cent coin. What do you get? Bread, oil, cheese, cash, three dollars. There you go. Have a nice day. Okay, let me stock this bottles real quick before somebody else goes to check out. Okay, back to the thing. Who just in time? Well, actually, I had some time to spare. Look how fast I'm. I even had time to spare. I even had spare time. But I don't have the spare change. But I'd rather have the spare time than the spare change. I value time more than money. What am I talking about? <laughs> oh, he bought the tea. I think you're the first person to buy the tea. What was he looking for? Oh, powdered sugar. I'm already out of powdered sugar. Damn, they bought, they bought that up fast. See, this is what I'm talking about. If I had a cashier, I could be like replacing that right now. I mean, I probably could do that anyway. Buy some more and replace it. But it's just like kind of a pain to get off the register, order it, go stock it, and then get back on the register. Then you get like halfway through stocking it and somebody's ready to check out. So you gotta drop the box, check them out, check a few people out, then get off the register and restock it. It's like real, it's like actually how it's like to work retail. It's like that. Like you're trying to do a task, but you keep having to check people out and you never can finish the task. It's stressful, man. I'd rather just not do the task at all. Ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba -ba. Depends on what kind of store you work at. If it's real busy or if you get a lot of like slow, slow period. Man, I've been in some stores where we get some slow. We go like a whole hour and not get a single customer. We have some slow days, man. You, you could task on those days, that's for sure. Bro, I gotta turn on the light. It's getting dark, but I have customers. That's what I'm talking about. I can't. I can't even do a simple task like turn on the light. So I'm literally stuck on the register. I can't even go off the register for one second. There we go. Barely. Barely had enough time to turn, to flip a light switch. I barely had enough time in between customers to flip a light switch. And I'm supposed to stock the shelves? Bro, that's real life, bro. That's some real shit right there. Can I move these lights over? Because it's just like so dark over there on that side. Can I sp space them out a little closer to that end? Before I buy, because eventually I'm going to buy new lights, but like for now, can I just move those a little bit closer to the wall? Spread the light out a little bit more evenly. 275. Bro, 50 cent coins is not like a common coin people carry, right? There's no way. No, it's like quarters is like the highest coin that is like commonly carried and used in like in cash registers. Like, I'm sure there are 50 cent coins, and I know there's a dollar coins. But it can't be like a thing that you're gonna have in your register. Like, not that many people can be using 50 cent coins. There's no way. There's no way. I don't see it. I don't see it. But then again, I don't know what country we're supposed to be in. But the money sure does look like American money. I didn't actually really take a minute to look at them. Oh, it's 100% American money. Now that I'm actually looking at it, I didn't actually pay any attention to the the pictures, the the faces on the money dollars. But now that I'm actually look now that I actually looked at the money dollars, it's very 100% clearly American money. But I didn't pay any attention before. Cha ching Bro, we're closed. Thank you for your purchase. One, two, three, four, fifty cents. Thank you, have a nice day. Bro, we can definitely hire somebody now. We can definitely. 238 profit, nice. Alright. Nice, bro, this is gonna be so good. Bro, why didn't we sell a whole lot of water? We didn't sell some things. Okay. I think I'm gonna make this the last day. I'm gonna hire somebody. I'm gonna see how that goes. We're gonna do one more day and we'll probably end it. First of all, what's my bills looking like? Oof, they're getting steep, man. 
hiring. I still have, bro, I'm one checkout away from hiring somebody. I'm gonna have to do one checkout and then hire somebody. All right, let's 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 go ahead and get our stock. I'll check one person out and then I'll hire somebody. Um, What do I need? I don't think I need water. Um, Cheese, maybe milk I need. Oh man, it's hard to remember. Let's start with milk and hold up. I need bread. I need flour. I need this. I need oil. I definitely need the sugar. I need milk. Okay. Um. I don't need any more black tea. Do I need more coffee? Uh, I think I could use some more coffee. Let's get some more coffee and some more cheese. Why not? And then, oh, can I move this shit over? I can. Yeah. Right about there somewhere. That way it's just brighter over here. Because it was really dark right there. Okay, let's stock this stuff. We'll check out one customer, and then we'll we'll hire a, a cashier. I can't believe I have 199 out of 200. Like, I literally just needed one more. I'm gonna have to put this somewhere. Uh, and I'm gonna have to refill this as soon as I can. Like, as soon as somebody buys cheese, I gotta refill it. So that cheese doesn't go bad. I don't know if product can actually go bad in this game. I don't wanna chance it. I don't wanna risk it. Bro, people be buying this shit up, bro. What's up with the powdered sugar? Like, oh man, they love it. They be buying it. We definitely in America. They buying all, up all the powdered sugar so fast. We're definitely in America. Look, they driving on the left side of the road. Too. I mean, the right side of the road. Yeah, <laughs> we definitely in America. Bro. Actually, what other countries besides America drive on the right side? I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. Okay, one more box. Bread. I feel like we're missing something on the shelf over here. Oh, choco cereal. Forgot about the choco chippies. Choco chicky peas. I definitely need more of that. Let's let's get that. Bro, if I didn't make money, bro, what if I hire a guy and then I didn't have enough money to pay him? Would he quit and I'd have to hire a new guy? What if that happened? That would be crazy. Okay, let's make sure all these prices are good. 275 is good. 325 is good. Three dollars. Maybe I want to go like 315. Go a little bit higher. Um 325, that's good. Eleven. Let's go a little lower. Let's go like 10.75. We're having a sale on uh, on coffee today. 25, 25 cents off. Be sure to get your 25 cents off coffee before we bump the price right back up tomorrow. Okay, and then this tea down here, seven. Okay, that's good. 5.25, that's good. Five dollars. Yep, 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 yep. What's this one? Uh, 556. Mm, you know, I'm going to leave it at 6 because that was flying off the shelf. Even with the high price. Okay, we're going to open. We're going to check out one customer. Hey, everybody, come to my store. Bro, with the cashier in here, I could open the store and just leave. Just leave the cashier and just like, Hey, you want to buy some powdered sugar? Come on, I got powdered sugar in here. I got choco chicky peas. They're chocolate. I got milk, I got cheese. You know you want some food. Come on, oh yeah, let's go. Yeah, I could just leave the cashier in here and then uh, just, just wander off. Just literally just wander off. Have a nice day, okay. Let's hire somebody before someone comes in here. Management, hiring. Required store level 10? No, what's my store level? How can I see what my store level is?
bro. I don't know what my store level. Oh, it's seven. No, I can't hire anyone until store level ten. So do I have to get more things in here? Like, do I need to get another like fridge or something, or like another a license? Oh, I could buy this license. Let's do it. I bought another product license. I spent all my money on another product license. <laughs> That's okay, because we'll make money. We'll make money. I'm going to need, like, another cooler in here, too. Man, I really thought we were going to be able to hire a cashier today. Dang, man. We'll have to save that for next stream. Next time we stream it. That's unfortunate. That is so sad. Beep, 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 beep. Yeah, man. What do I do to up the store level? Is it just as I make purchases? Or if I get, like... If I get... If I buy things... Like... If I buy furniture and things. I really do need like a freezer or something. So I can... What, what was that product license I bought? For? Did I get anything frozen? No. Okay, so I don't need a freezer yet. Yeah, so like... Okay, so I just keep making sales. I'm already at store level 8, so it won't be that much longer until I'm at store level 10, I think. That's what I needed to be, right? To hire somebody? I think that's what it was. Let me check again. Um, 10. Yeah, I need to be 10. Okay. It's not that much longer. I don't even hear you come in. We should have one of those doors with little jingly bell that when they come in, you can hear it like ding a ling a ling. That'll be good. I'm just standing on the counter. Hey, welcome in. Welcome to my store. Where the employees stand on the counter and do a little dance. Hi, welcome, welcome. I'm just pacing back and forth on top of this checkout. He's just gonna ignore it and just put stuff on the counter. He's not even like caring that I'm like walking on the counter. He does not care. He's gonna put stuff right on this counter and not even like react to me like running around on this counter. See, watch. He doesn't care. He's like, check me out. Ding, ding, ding. You gotta love NPCs in games. How they don't react to like stuff. That in real life, you'd be like, what the hell are you doing up on the counter? Why are you running around on the counter? Get down. Crazy. <laughs> That's what he would say in real life, but in the game, he's just like, I'm ready to check out, please. Beep, 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 beep. I like the little beep noises. Satisfying. Everybody wants eggs, bro, but I just don't have the second, second cooler. Ching. Give me that money. Thank you. Have a nice day. That's all you're gonna buy, really. Really? That's it? Come on. You came in for one thing. Yo, what's up, DJ? Nice simulator game. Yeah, it's so fun. Thank you for coming to the stream. Thank you, thank you. How are you doing today? Yeah, it's a simulator game. It's really fun. It's really good so far. We've expanded the store. Um, we got more space in here now. We have a little cooler, like, refrigerator thing we didn't have before. And we're getting close to be able to hire a cashier, so I don't have to check people out manually. But it's going to be a little bit... Because we're at store level 8, and we need to be at store level 10. Look like gas station simulator without pump or car wash or alligators. Oh, man. I forgot about gas station simulator. That was a cool game. Oh my gosh, I forgot about that game. That was a really cool game, too. I never played it, but like I watched people play it on YouTube. I always wanted to play it. It looked really fun. Maybe we can play that on stream one time. 
I totally forgot about th Yeah, that is a good game. This is like that. But without the gas pumps. And like the weird stuff that happens. Like the whole thing about the uncle loaning you money and you gotta pay him back and all that stuff. Wasn't that something that like happened? I, I vaguely remember it. There was some like weird stuff going on in that. It was cool though. It was really cool. Yeah. You could like flip the cars over if he used... There was like a tool you could... Was it the broom? I don't know, it had some bugs when it was in early access. I don't remember if this is like the broom. You could you could use something to flip cars over. I think it was the broom. It was like a bug. I forget. I watched Let's Game It Out. You know, Josh from Let's Game It Out. I watched him play it and he like he like broke the game, as he does always. It was so funny. The aliens and the mafia uncle. I remember the mafia uncle, but I don't remember the aliens. Was cool, perfect perfected it too, but yeah. Look a bit like it. Yeah, it does look a little bit like it. Bro, I need more lighting in here. It feels so dark. I moved the lights over, which helps, so it doesn't feel so dark where the shelves are. Like, the shelves feel more bright, but now it feel, and it still feels bright on this side, but in the middle. Like, now it feels dark in the middle, like, right where, like, the cash register is. Like, where the belt is and everything. The broom. Yeah, it's actually a success to fly a car. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. That was so funny. I liked watching him play the game and, like, essentially break it on purpose. You guys were close. Really? You're going to come in here and buy all this stuff after close? Actually, I will take your money, though. Thank you. I do need your money. So I will accept it. Get out. Never come back in here after close ever again. Oh, let me stock this cheese before it goes bad. Okay. Do we make profit? Do we make profit? Ooh, we lost money. Oof. Ah. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to stay in lurk because I'm hungry and we'll have supper time. Okay, no problem. Eat the supper. Have a good supper. I just had an Uncrustable a minute ago. <laughs> um. Okay. I didn't sell a lot of milk. What's the deal with that? I feel like my prices are reasonable too. Interesting. Okay, let's get let's order the th things that we didn't have before. It's like salt, rice thingy, pasta thingy, olive oil, flour, peanut butter, tea. We're at two fifty one now. Um I guess I can go coffee, coffee, powdered sugar, because they sell the shit out of that, that choco cereal, that's probably all I should buy, that's like probably too much shit, I might have to buy an extra rack, honestly, yeah, this is probably like way too much shit, that's fine, oh, that's not what I thought that was, that's fine, we can put that there, I don't even think I ordered, reordered what actually went there. Um, let's just throw this down here for now. What even is that? I don't even read what that is. Is that like olive oil? Spaghetti. I still don't have any pasta sauce. What is this? What is this? Okay, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's rice. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what is this? What are those? Okay, the cereal. Chokipi. Chokip. How do you pronounce this? Chokipik. Chokipik. I like to say Chokopiki. Chokopiki sounds way better than Chokipik. And the Nutella. No, that's just peanut butter. But it's in a, like a Nutella shaped thing. But it's literally just peanut butter. Okay, we better make a lot of money today. Because by the time. Because I need like to hire a cashier. I think by the time we get to level 10, we probably have enough money. But I also need like more racks and more like... I need more shelf space and more like... Cooler space. I really need more cooler space, honestly. I could I could stand to buy another cooler. For real, for real. Nice. Okay. So we filled up the shelves pretty much. I could buy another flower. I guess I could do that. Buy another flower. 
Might as well. Might as well buy the flower. And then, bro, I really want to buy another cooler, but I don't even think I can. I think they're worth like 200. Yeah. Oh shit, I was already where I could buy that. Yeah, they're like 200. So yeah, I don't need one right now. I couldn't buy one right now anyway. Oh, I didn't refill the water. Oh shit. Okay, let's get the water. Let's get the water. I don't think I'm worried about the cheese at the moment. Yeah, I'm not worried about the cheese. Who needs cheese? Who actually wants to buy cheese? Nobody's going to come in here and buy cheese. As if. Oh shit. I forgot to check the prices. Oh, the time's going now. Now that I pressed open, it doesn't matter. 275. Now that feels steep with 240. No, it doesn't. No, that's fine. Uh, cheese, 325. Yes, that's fine. Water, 315. That's fine. I didn't even set prices for this shit. Oh, shit, bro. Okay, $7 for this. Let's assign prices to the new stuff before I'm giving it away from free. 725 for that, bro. He's trying to get all the stuff I haven't set prices for yet. No, you gotta wait. 215. There we go. And then Nutella. 575. I can't believe I forgot. I opened the store. Um, okay, let's make this seven dollars even. Let's check this guy out. Uh bro, he's gonna get some of this shit for free, bro. Oh my god, for like the same amount of money that I paid for it. Oh no, brother, that's terrible. Okay, 35, 30, uh, 45, 67, 48. I can't believe I did that, bro. Bro, she just got this... Oh, no, she didn't. Okay. I was like, you just got this for free. No. Bro, stop picking shit off off the shelf, bro. I didn't... I didn't price that yet, dude. No. Stop, 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 stop. No. Okay, is everything else priced? I think it is. Oh, my God. I didn't price everything, bro. I can't believe that. I can't believe I'm just giving away shit. Okay, I gotta check all the prices. Oh my god, dude. Um, what's this one? 1075, fine. Salt. 215, that's fine. Four dollars, that's good. 425, good. Oh yeah, we already checked that one. Rice was 725, good, 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 good. Oil, 525, that's good. Gotta remember, we were on the Choco... Choco Peas. What was it called? Choco Peaky. That's what I called it. Choco Peakies. Choco Peakies. Oh, shit, bro. We're basically giving away the Choco Peakies. No. 575. 7. I can't believe I forgot to do this. $6 is fine. $7? No! Bro, 725. I'm just giving shit away, bro. That's terrible. What's this? Six, okay, okay. Okay, we're good now. We're good. Oh my god, dude. I can't believe I did that. Bro, I was just giving stuff away for the same price that I paid for it. That's crazy. That's actually so crazy. Oh, somebody bought water. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I think by the time we reach level 10, we should be good. I think I'll buy another cooler. Another cooler so I can put more, so I can get eggs and stuff. And then roll with that. And then by the time we reach level 10, we can we can surely afford to pay for a cashier. Hire a cashier. One dollar. No holler. Gotta get a sip of water. All right, look at all the stuff. Yeah, big purchase. Big purchase, let's go. A lot of customers, we're doing good. Bro, the more we like build up the store, the more like different types of products we get, the more money we're gonna make each day. And then it's just gonna snowball. It's gonna be like a snowball effect to, to the point where we're getting like tons of money each day. And then we're able to like do a lot of upgrades and stuff. It's gonna be great. I can see the progress. 
I can feel it in my bones. Ooh, look at this big purchase. Oh, dude, that's what's good about having multiple types of products and people are going to spend more money. Nice. Oh, he only got three things. Wow. That's it. Bro, what a weak purchase. I love how I'm, like, making fun of the customer for not buying enough. That's all you bought? Cringe. Okay, that's lame. $25.35. 42 25 Big money spender. Oh, only $19? Cringe. Oh, yeah, here we go. Look at all this. Oh, it's only 22 Okay, never mind. <laughs> Ow, I had to pop my neck. The sun's starting to go down. I'm going to need to turn on those lights soon, but we got to save all the electricity we can. We don't want to run up the electricity bill. we gotta, we got to wait till the last possible minute to turn on the lights till it gets pitch black. Bro, imagine if, like, the customers complain if you leave the lights off. Like, it's dark in here. I can't see anything. That will be so funny. I do need new lights really badly. I need two more lights. I wonder how much those cost. They're only $40 a piece, bro. Get two of those things. Oops. Yeah, I needed to get those a long time ago. I don't know why I waited. They were so cheap. They're so cheap. I might as well have got those like forever ago. Okay. Let me. Oh no 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 no. Okay. Let me. Yeah. Use it. Nice. Okay, I'll be right there with you, sir. Exact change. Let's go. You bought one thing, dude. Really? Get out of here. Never come back here again. Is that a good spot for him? I feel like that's pretty bright. I mean, I guess I could have offset them a little bit. So they were more in the middle. I feel like it's nice and bright in here now. I feel like that's good. Yeah, it feels comfy. Nice and bright. I definitely needed two more lights. For sure. And they were cheap, so I might as well have done it. I don't know why I was waiting for so long. 220. Have a nice day. Or night. Or both. I still have a lot of product left over, which is concerning. What are they doing, bro? They're like glitched out. You all better buy a lot of shit, because it's 9 o'clock. We are closed, people. You all better buy a lot of stuff. Bro, there's still people coming in. Yo, we can keep the store open even though we're closed. Like, people are still coming in. Even though it's, like, closing time, like, customers are still coming in, bro. That's fine. Let's make the extra money. Let's make that money. That's fine with me. But I need them to stop, like, glitching out, though. I still got product. Come on in. Give me your monies. And the time stops progressing anyway. At 9. So it's like, I could just sit here forever and infinitely get money. As long as I had product. Bro, but, like, these guys are glitched out. So I think I'm just going to end it. They're not moving. They're just glitched out. We only got 56 money in profit. Weird. Okay, Ron sliced bread, the market price went up. I have to remember the oh shit, I, okay. Ron sliced bread, okay. So let's get a fridge unit. Do I want a big fridge? Or can I sell the little fridge if I, well let's buy a big fridge, well how much does it, can I sell this fridge for? Well, I can't. Well, is there no way to sell? Well, can he not sell? What if I want to sell furniture? Like, because what if I bought a bunch of furniture and I couldn't sell it? And then what would happen? Would I break the game because I couldn't put them anywhere? Okay. I want to buy a big fridge, but like... Only if I can sell the little one. Because I don't need both. I guess I could just buy another little fridge. But that feels stupid. 
when I could have a big one. Yo, what? I don't think I can sell it. Yo, what? That's weird. Maybe they just haven't added that in yet. That's like something they should hopefully add in sooner rather than later. Because like, I need to sell that so I can upgrade. I don't know what else should I do. Should I buy a big one? Or just like go ahead and buy a small one. Oh man. I think I'll just buy another small one. Since I can't sell it. And I need money to like right now to like. Oh I can sell it if it's still in the box. But once it's out of the box I can't sell it. That's like not great because. I still need to be able to sell it later if I don't need it anymore. At least for like a sl like a slightly lower price or something. Okay. Things I don't need. This flower, the choco chicky peas, and the tea. I don't need. I don't need flour, choco chickies, or the tea. But I do need like refrigerated products that I didn't get before. Let's get one of these, one of these, one of these. Oh wait, do I have two different types of flour? I do. Weird. I didn't notice that. Oh, this is getting pricey really quick. Oh, shit. Max? Oh, I can only order 10 things at a time? Weird. Okay. Weird. That is odd. Okay, it's fine. Not a huge deal. Oh, man. I don't have storage either, so I'm going to have random boxes. <laughs> I'm gonna have random boxes like sitting around. Cause I don't have storage yet. I can throw this one away. Bro, all these boxes would not be fitting in this little trash can. We would need like a big trash compactor. Like a cardboard smusher or like garbage smusher thing. You would not be getting all that. Fitting all this in this little thing. In this little bitty trash can. There's no way. That is unrealistic. You gotta break those boxes down and throw them in the in the smusher. Throw them things in the smush. In the smushy. Bro, I need storage. But more than I need storage, I need um a cashier. I really need a cashier. Bro, everyone bought this expensive supreme flower. Is it the same Supreme as the clothing brand? That is so funny if it if it is. Supreme! Bro, everyone bought the Supreme and nobody bought the cheap flower. Interesting. Everyone likes the more expensive item. They like to feel like they're fancy. They're like, I'll buy this one because it makes me feel special. I get that. Eggs. I finally got eggs. Let's go. Let's go eggs. What's this? Salt? Okay, I guess I have some extra shelf space I can throw some things on. Like, I have this extra shelf. What do I have the most of? Okay, four, four, and three, okay. So I can throw these on here then. And, let's see. I can throw these up here. And that's all I can do for right now. Unless somebody buy it, because I can't, like, take this. Oh, I can. Okay, nice. And then, is there anything else? Like, okay, no. Uh, get rid of that for now. Uh, let's place these. There we go. That's good. Right? That's good. Yeah, that's perfect. Alright! Should I buy more stuff? No, I don't have enough money. I was gonna say, could I, should I buy more stuff for the cooler since I have more room, like water? But I don't think I have enough money to buy water. Maybe I do. Let's try it. Yeah, I can buy water. Let's do that. I need money for bills too, though. Like, I'm not gonna be able to pay the bills. I'm gonna run out of bill money. Let's definitely remember to set the prices this time. And not accidentally forget that. That was bad. Last time. Um, let's check my bills too while I'm at it. 
Oof. Okay, I can pay these. Oh, but not the rent. Oh, shit. I can't pay the rent. Oh. Oh, no. I'm going to have to pay that soon. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's check the prices real quick. Let's see. Eggs, 408. So let's make that like 425. I think if we just go 25 cents or so above the market price, I feel like that's the optimal. So, because if you go too much higher than that, then they'll stop buying it. But if you go lower, then like you're just cheating yourself out of money. Because they'll totally pay it. They'll totally pay it if it's like 25 cents higher. So if you only go like 10 cents higher, like you could be getting more money that, that you're not getting. So I was just like roughly 25 cents higher on most of these. Six dollars, that's good. Four dollars, that's good. Five seventy-five, that's good. Seven twenty-five, that's good. Five twenty-five, that's good. Choco chicky peas, six dollars, that's great. I already checked the Nutella. That's actually supposed to be peanut butter, but it looks just like Nutella. Uh, seven, perfect. Six, that's about fifty cents higher. But they go for this though. It's like they're addicted to the the powdered sugar, bro. It's like a drug. Even if I make it, like, more money, they still buy it. Okay, we're perfect. We're golden. Open the store. Open the store. I gotta pay rent, man. I'm, I'm due behind two payments. I owe them $35 times two. And I still haven't been able to pay it. I need this money, bro. I need this. Come on, customers. Come on, man. We're having a sale. There's nobody out here. You guys, come on. I'm running a sale down here. Hey, 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 you want some eggs? I got eggs. You need eggs? Hey, man, I got eggs. I know a place where you can get some eggs. Hey, man, you want some eggs? I got a nice place for this. Oh, my God, a truck. Oh, shit. Oh, man, I almost got hit by a car. Hey, lady, you want some eggs? I got some eggs. They're real cheap. Hell, yeah, I knew you wanted those eggs. Look at them right here, 425 I bet you never seen eggs this low, this cheap before. I bet you can't believe your mind at these prices. You're shocked. You'd be shocked. Hey, lady, come on, look, I got some eggs. Look, 425. You'll be shocked at these prices. These prices will shock you. Now we're in business. Now we're making money, quite literally. Look at the customer just flooding in. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, give me money. Yeah, yeah, come on in the store. Yeah. Buy some eggs. Yeah, I knew you wanted the eggs. Yeah, you wanted those eggs, didn't you? I seen you looking at those eggs. Come on, man. Come in here. Let's freaking go, bro. We're about to make so much money. We're about to be filthy rich. We are so rich. Dude, look at all these customers in my in my store. Too expensive milk? Bro, get out of here. You won't find a cheaper place for milk, okay? These milk prices, unbeatable. Unbeatable. You will literally be shocked. You'll be so shocked you'll have to go to the hospital. Like you'll have a, a, a pro you'll have like a medical problem. You'll be so frightened. You cannot beat these prices. Choco chicky bees. Three twenty five. This is theft? Bro, don't no. Don't look at all these customers in here. You might think it's too expensive, but these people don't. They're all buying all my shit, bro. I can't keep the stock on the shelves. Look, you said the milk was expensive. This guy bought two of them. If they're so expensive, explain why he bought two. Okay. Okay. Explain that. Yo, I need to stock these now. That they've, like, gotten rid of most of it. Okay, I'll, okay, I'll just put that back. I don't want to replace this because this is my spot for the powdered sugar. Powdered sugar. Sugar. Oh, I can buy these or pay these for bills now. Pay my rent. My overdue rent payments. Bro, we're about to make so much money, bro. Look at all this shit she bought. Two things of eggs, too. That's two whole things of eggs. Oh, shit. No, no, no. Go back. There we go. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, beep. Oh, credit card payment. Let's go. Beep, 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 beep. Have you ever been into a store that's like, we can't accept a credit card unless you spend like X amount of money? Like, you must spend at least $10 or we won't take credit card. I'm like, lame. I know why they do it, but most stores don't do it because the amount that they owe. Because it's like, they 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 have to owe a fee, right? For the, the to the bank or whoever, or the card. I don't know how it works, but like... 
they pay so much for every like card transaction i guess so if it's not over like three dollars or something like that it's not worth it because they have to pay like three dollars every time or something so like if someone bought a dollar thing then they're losing they're literally like losing two dollars instead of getting a dollar but it's like it's so negligible for most businesses that it doesn't matter like mcdonald's doesn't give a shit if you buy a, a one drink for like a dollar fifty and pay with a card like they don't give a shit bro that amount of money they lost on that sale is so negligible they're gonna make so much profit that day anyway it's like and i understand more for like small businesses or for like family-owned businesses but even for them for the most part they're just kind of being silly like most of them don't really need to like be like only use credit card if you spend three dollars or more like most of them really really don't or like need to do that like it wouldn't be a big deal if they just let people use their credit card I can see for like really small, like really tiny businesses that don't do a lot of sales, or especially that don't do a lot of big sales. They sell a lot of cheap things, a lot of things that are a dollar, two dollars, a lot of small items that are under three dollars or around three dollars. Like I can understand, but most shops sell a lot of things that are like well over three dollars. So like it's it would be fine if they sold occasionally something under dollars with the car i'm just saying some people are like they're a little too they're too like like they care about that too much i'm trying to stock this hello can't you say i'm working here that's all you're gonna buy really really wow get out of my store see if i had a cashier right now i could be restocking these shelves these people would be buying more things but I'm like, I've already ran out of a bunch of things they probably wanted. But I don't have a cashier, so I can't really get off the register to restock. Bro, everyone likes the Supreme flower, even though I have a cheaper flower. They're literally just buying it because it says Supreme. That's the only reason. It says Supreme. Oh, this guy knows what's up. He bought the cheap flower, bro. He's sa he's a money saver. This is my kind of guy right here. He knows what's up. Other people be buying a Supreme flower for no good reason. What the hell is that about? Alright, I think I'm going to probably make this the last night that I do. It's going to take several more nights, I think, before we... Oh, but look at all these people in here. Oh, and it's dark. This is probably going to be one of the last nights that I do. Um, I wanted to get a, a cashier, but like I think it's going to take several more nights. I'm kind of tired. I kind of wanted to end this stream like 45 minutes ago <laughs> on the count of me being really tired because I only slept like four hours last night. Um... But yeah, I just really wanted to get that cashier, and then I ended up playing it longer. That's how it always happens, though. Like, just one more. I always have, like, a goal in mind. Like, just one more thing, and then... Oh, my God, look at all this money we're making. So, like, I'll just do one more thing, and then... I'll, uh... I'll be done, and then it just... It takes longer and longer to do it. And then I end up streaming for, like, hours past what I meant to. That's, like, kind of what's happening right now. So I really need to end it after this night. Because if I keep going until I get a cashier, I'll end up playing it for like another hour. So like, I'll save that for next stream. But we got a lot of money though, right now. And I don't need to buy any more furniture right now. Like I'm good on shelving and on refrigerators right now. So, so all this money I'm making on this day can go towards like products. And I won't spend, I have 600, 600. I'm not going to spend 600, you know what I mean? I'll spend like 200 maybe on products the next day. So I'll be making good money, I think. So by the time I reach level 10, I'll have plenty of money to hire a cashier. And maybe I'll eventually I'll finally be able to like expand the store and unlock storage and all that stuff. Probably be able to do all that next stream. Okay, are you guys actually going to buy anything or are you just going to glitch out? I think they're just going to glitch out. So I'm going to go ahead and end it. Profit of 136. Alright, this game is really fun. Um, I really like it. I'm excited to play it again. I would keep playing it right now. And I'm just so tired. About 45 minutes ago, I started to feel it. I started to crash. I was like, oh, my energy. My my energy, it's waning. It's waning fast. Like, oh god, I, I, I'm going to fall asleep. <laughs> I need to, need to be done. But then I just kept going because I wanted to get the cashier. Yeah, I think we'll save that for next time. I really like this game, though. I'm excited to expand it more. Make the store bigger. Unlock storage would be cool. 
um, unlock more. Like, there's still so much, like, product things I haven't got yet. Licenses. Look at all this stuff. There's a lot. There's a lot to unlock. Um, there's still a lot of, like, growth. Look at all this stuff. Oh, man. We could have a huge supermarket eventually. Which will certainly be interesting. Um, you know, all these different... Dude, we can have restockers, dude. That's cool. And customization when they add it will be really nice when they add that into the game. It's still early access, so... Loans? Bro, I'm, so far, I have not needed to rely on loans, and I don't think I want to because you got to pay all that shit back plus interest. And so far, I haven't needed them at all, so why use them? I've been able to progressively grow and up the store without without needing the loans, so I don't think I want to use the loans. But yeah. So next time we play this, this will be... That will be the goal to get a cashier, which we'll probably do really quickly, and then, you know, continue to grow and expand and that kind of thing. So this should be a lot of fun. I really enjoyed this. I relived a lot of my my memories of the retail days, but I also had a lot of fun, and, uh, and like, trash talking the customers was kind of funny. Like, doing that. <laughs> yeah, it's fun. I like it. Supermarket Simulator. Good game. Really cheap. Get it on Steam. It's in early access, but I'm sure they're working on it. Gonna add more stuff, so... Totally check it out, buy the game for yourself, try it out. And yeah, let's see what we got going on tomorrow real quick. Um, let me pull up the schedule here. Yeah, so that's what's up in the air. So tomorrow will either be, oh, Lorcana, that was the thing. I thought it was Sifu, okay. I said Sifu earlier, but Lorcana was what we had for Thursday. Tomorrow's Wednesday. Depending on when I hear back from my friend... Uh, we may play Overwatch tomorrow, or we may play it Thursday. The problem is, he's in a different time zone. He said Thursday, but I didn't know if he meant my Thursday or his Thursday. Because for him, it's like, it's going to be 10 a.m. for him. It's going to be 9 p.m. for me. So he said, 9 p.m. your time. He said, on Thursday, and then, he, and then in a separate message, he said, 9 p.m., your time and 10 a.m. my time. So, okay, but who's Thursday? Is that 9 p.m. my Thursday, 10 a.m. your Friday? Or 9 p.m. my Wednesday, 10 a.m. your Thursday? Anyway, I just want to do the collab stream because I haven't done a collab stream yet. It'll be my first ever collab stream, and I think it'll be really fun. I'm really excited, so it's worth swapping them if need be to fit his schedule because there's no big deal to just switch Overwatch with Lorcana and just swap those two days. In order to fit his schedule, in order to us, uh, so we can do a collab stream, because it would be so worth it. Because it'd be a lot of fun. I've never done it before. It'd be awesome. Okay. Anyway, um, that's all I have to say. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, so much who came to the stream today and who chatted in the chat. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. As always, if you're watching this back as a recording, please leave a like and a comment. It really helps me out. It boosts the videos and the algorithm. Helps more people see them. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do. I'm trying to grow the channel. I want to do big things. I got big plans. Every little bit helps. And I really appreciate every single bit. Thank you so much. I will see you guys tomorrow, 9 p.m. Eastern Time, for either Overwatch 2 or Locana. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Matane. Good night. Bye-bye.